I lived, bitch. I lived. I lived. It's gonna take a lot more than that to keep me down. No poop day could kill me. No poop day could kill me. How'd it go? How'd the poop go? It went well. Uh, I, uh, I had a, a lovely colonoscopy where they, uh, gave me pictures of the inside of my intestines, which I did not know they just gave you. The doctor, I had, like, the head of the GI division of my hospital doing mine, and he, like, came up to me and was like, here, take this. And it was, like, a bunch of pictures with notations from him on what's going on in my intestines, and he was like, this is for you. And I was like, thanks, cool. Wow, neato. Thanks, John G.I. Wow, it was autographed. But, uh, good news is, according to him, it does not look like I have colon cancer, so that's cool. Uh, it looks like I have Crohn's disease, which is a little better. Oh, uh, that's a better- that's better than cancer. Guys, everyone get excited! That's better than cancer! <laughs> that's way better than cancer, to be fair. But yeah, I got some kind of- it looks like I got some kind of small intestinal disease going on. So now I have to eat a camera. <laughs> now I have to- Look, chat, I mean, I'm not complaining too much about this disease that he says I may have, because I have not dealt with many bad symptoms as a result of it. He thinks I have a very minor version of it. So I'm not gonna be too spooked or have too much of an issue right now. I've not been having a hard time, really. Uh, despite the fact that my intestines say otherwise. But, uh, yeah, I have to eat a camera now. <laughs> He's like, you're gonna have to eat this pill? Probably? And it's gonna send pictures of your small intestine to, to me. And I'm like, oh, okay. It's like some magic school bus shit. Can we see the pictures? No. No, you cannot. Those are my pri those go into my private collection. Those are part of my private collection now. I wonder if those breach TOS. Maybe. I don't know. Probably not. They're just pictures of like skin <laughs> basically <laughs> like there was no point where my like where my intestines are oh, like anything other than just skin in there really that's and that was the cool thing is that if it was anything other than that it would have been likely concerning for the doctors but it was all just skin top to bottom Lidaring your insides would probably make a great TTT map. <laughs> okay, psycho. Okay, insane maniac in the chat. Okay, man, chill. <laughs> chill a second. Just chill one sec. What? Take it easy. That's content. Dude. I'll tell you what, though, yesterday was actually not, like, the, the prep was only bad because, like, I didn't even have a bad time. Like, I actually handled poop day probably better than I believe a lot of people handle poop day. Mine was, I had such an easy time. The most annoying part of the whole thing was that, like, I needed to wake up at, like, 3 a.m. to, like, do part two, which was annoying. That was, like, the only part of it that was, like, even, like, really inconvenient to me. So it didn't make you nauseated? No. I didn't get nauseated. I felt pretty good pretty much the whole time. I do not think a many of you understand, okay, that we are not the same. <laughs> I feel like sometimes you guys relate to me too much, despite the fact that you are falling apart and I am so powerful and I would appreciate it if you stopped relating to me. 
because we are not the same. How do you like the taste? It was also not bad. <laughs> Chad, it tasted like someone spilled like a little bit of the wrong chemical into old, like, Sprite, if that makes sense. Like, it tasted like Sprite that someone put like something a little wrong into. Like, Chemical X was poured into this Sprite. <laughs> Someone, someone bonked over like a fucking flask of some chemical off of a counter at Sprite HQ. Sprite more like Sprong. Yeah, I was kind of drinking Sprong, that's right. And I downed it easy peasy, no problems. It was easy, dude. I could have totally done that live. Although, I'll be honest, um... And maybe it's because I had like a newer, updated, more powerful version because like... That's just what I got, but, um, while, well, yeah, I could have drank it live, the the length of the stream after I drank it, this, this sprong, would have been about three minutes. <laughs> it took about three minutes for my body to be like, what's up? Wake up now, get up! You gotta go! It was, like, actually kind of shocking. Like, I was expecting it, because I didn't- well, I didn't know what to expect, so I was expecting it to be bad, so I was, like, already near the bathroom, but I was like, holy shit. This thing- this thing might be the most powerful drink I've ever drank in my life. Got that fast-acting brand? Yeah, I mean... Needless to say, if a doctor was like, you need to do another one of these, I'd be- I'd shrug and I'd be like, well, the only real bummer is that I can't, like, eat any decent food for, like, five days, really. That was the only, like, real- that was the hardest part, is just, like, not being able to eat- what did you eat afterwards? I had a fucking quesadilla, dude. I had a goddamn quesadilla, like a big heaping one, a big quesadilla, lots of stuff within it. And then when I, when I woke up, I got myself a, 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 a poke bowl. Oh yeah, got a lot of fish in me. Cause I didn't want to have anything like too, like... I didn't want to stack up on like two greasy things back to back, so I had like a I had a bunch of fish and stuff and like rice. Dude. Let me tell you what though, that quesadilla was the best quesadilla I ever fucking ate after how long it took me, like after how long I wasn't able to eat anything. Like that was decent. Damn, man. Damn, man. Damn, man. On an empty stomach, too. A, a truly empty stomach. Yeah. But yeah, now I don't have to- now I don't have to stress so much about, uh, the fucking possibility of having some horrible thing going on. I mean, I, it's not done. I still have other shit to do. But I- they are very confident I don't have cancer, and that's cool. That's good. Cause that- that was definitely keeping me up at night the last, like, week and a half. So now I can at least chill a little. But yeah, we'll do three streams. Uh, I'm taking Saturday and Sunday off. We'll be back on Monday after that. Uh, I'm not doing anything... Uh, on stream over the holidays. I'm just not gonna. So, you'll see, you'll hear from me come the 26th, after, after the Friday stream. Santa would be mad about the competition. I mean, I know, like, not everyone, like... Like, usually- sometimes I will stream on, like, the 24th and stuff, but, like, it lands on the weekends that I've already tried to more specifically say, like, hey, I don't want to work on those days anymore, I want to have those days, like, separate for my own other stuff, so. Yeah, no biggie. Besides, to be honest, I need, like, I need to- I need to, like, fucking sort out 
like what I'm doing for streams because like the last week I have just been this is this really fucked up my whole week like mentally not really so much like as in I didn't have time to do things but like mentally as in I didn't want to do things so fortunately that's out of the way now you got good news and then followed up by killing Brett's big boss with facts and logic That was a good stream. That was a that was a good D and D session. Brett really knocked it out of the park with that shit, dude. <clears throat> Yesterday was a really good D and D session. That was great. Yeah, I kind of defeated him with facts and logic. I kind of skipped chat. I, I I'm just gonna tell it to you straight. All right, Brett can say whatever he wants. He can deceive you however he chooses. I just face skipped. The first phase of the boss with facts okay that's that's what happened okay there was another phase i skipped it that's what happened you know it's always funny though <laughs> and i've talked to like i talked to some of the the party about this specific thing is that whenever the bomb has any kind of like character development where people are like wow he's not just a goofy asshole None of the party is there to witness it, so it's exclusively, like, only observed by chat. <laughs> like, literally not once has anything that's ever happened where, like, the bomb has had any kind of, like, meaningful moment. Has anyone been there but the bomb and, like, the DM? They'll never know how cool I am. They'll never know. <laughs> <laughs> they don't know how epic I am, dude. They don't know. None of them know. Only cool off screen. Yeah. I'm epic. <laughs> Epic, please, please understand, dude. Please. What is this game? Fake Minecraft. Remember the words you say right now. And watch yourself once the stream game starts, okay? <laughs> Remember what you say now. Write them down and then come back to me, okay? This game's fucked. And I'm playing it on hardcore. If I die, we restart. It's actually fun because I'm playing it essentially. Okay, here's the thing. Here's the thing. If it gets a little ridiculous, technically, there's a way that we can do it, which will cut out on a little bit of loading time. It is because on the highest difficulty of this game on hardcore, well, the highest difficulty in general. When you die, your spawn is randomly within 5,000 blocks of where you died. I'm never finding my body or house ever again because this highest difficulty also doesn't have a map system. So I can do hardcore without ever even reloading the game because I'm never finding my old house. Ever. Ever. So that's cool. That's cool. I don't have to make multiple worlds because if I die, I'm never getting my ship back. It's gone. <laughs> Which is really cool. Just follow the moss. There's no moss. Pity mechanic, enough deaths and you'll find previous stuff. It's all perfect. Is 5,000 blocks really that much? Yes. Uh, yes it is, as a matter of fact. Yes, that's a lot of blocks. In this game, there's not, this isn't like Minecraft, where there's like, there's less landmarks on this map to notice like, hey, there's, that thing over there that I recognize. Stuff's a lot more like normal looking in this game at the start. So like, once you lose something, once you get lost, you're lost, man. You're lost. 
And for context on the highest difficulty, if a, like I think a goat hits you with their head, you instantly die with no armor. Instantly. It's on sight. Most animals kill you and they don't even make footstep sounds. They don't even make footstep sounds. Okay. I know because I tested. Counting down to Tomato dying to a stealth grizzly bear attack. Look, Jet, here's the things I can guarantee. One, we're gonna get copper earlier this time than we did last time. They've added new methods to get it. You can you can pan for metals in like water now. <laughs> we don't have to find the vein. We can pan for copper in the water. Chat. We can use sand to find it. Delete that fucking clip. Thank you. Uh, this is a uh, no tilt Tuesday, dude. Okay. Actually, I guess today's Wednesday. Fuck. I missed my chance. All right, technically you can post it. It's not No Tilt Tuesday anymore. It's, uh, Wednesday. Fuck! Wangry Wednesday. That might be the- that's such a reach. to crack open a nice cold beer. Yeah, <sniffs> cold one. No, this is like this is cold brew. I don't drink beer. That'd be horrible. What a fast way to ruin my day. Cake <laughs> yeah. Kona beer is bad for you. I like this idea of a version of, like, the K-Kona meme where instead they just say, like, really, like, insightful, like, you know, genuinely concerned things for people like K-Kona. You should probably take care of yourself. You haven't been eating well. <laughs> K-Kona drink responsibly. Kona, your mother and I care about you a lot. Damn, man. Damn, man. Kate Kona, your mental health is important. Damn tear to my eye. Dude, I think the doctor is fucked with my nose though. You know, that's the one thing coming out of that colonoscopy. Feels like I got a cut in my nose and I don't know why. And like, I don't think the doctors did anything to my nose, but what if one of them had been like, I'm gonna fucking like, Put something up there. Like, guys, check it out. I'm gonna do a little prank. I'm gonna put something in there. Cause, like, my nose just fucking hurts. And it's been hurting ever since that day. But I know there was nothing they did to my nose. It was a colonoscopy. There was one point where the nurse asked, uh, if I was, like, doing, like, what kind of colonoscopy I was doing and if I was going, uh, like, upper or lower. And I was like, what does that mean? It's like, oh, we just need to check if, like, we're also putting the tube down your mouth. 
And I was like, you can't be asking me this here. This should have been something that you knew long before now, right? Like this is, you, you what, huh? Dug too deep and too greedily, oh Megalo. Like obviously they actually knew, but the person that was like checking to make sure that I had like all of my stuff like in a bag, like all my belongings was like just asking like random questions while they like talked to me. And I was just like, damn dude. The one, like, I, like, I was just, in the, in the middle of, like, the prep room, I was like, damn, I really lucked out in that they didn't also have me do that, because that may be the worst time of my life. If they all, if I also knew they had to do, like, they had to do my tummy. Nasogastric tube goes through the nose down the throat. Are you telling me what? Bro, I was out like a light man. And they sedated me with like fucking propofol. I was out. Maybe they did put something up my nose. What if they got halfway and then the nurse like kicked the door down? I was like, wait, he said he's not getting that one. And then they just were like, oh fuck. And they pulled it out. Because when I had an ENT put like a tube down my nose, my nose hurt the same way for like a fucking day. Hold up, man. Ain't no way. Ain't no way, man. You don't- No, 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 no way. <laughs> Wait a minute. One of the pictures on this thing my doctor gave me of all of my colonoscopy pictures. That's a picture of my brain. Huh? That- right here. This one right here. This is a picture of my brain. They might, the only way they could have gotten that picture is they were doing a drive-by of it when they were going to my tummy. Oh my god. It's really smooth. No wrinkles. Not one. Just looks like a butt. <laughs> just, it just looks like a butt. Butt brain. Bro got the lizard brain, ain't no way. <laughs> I... I don't let- no, that's not what lizard brain means, man. My- you- just because your brain's smooth doesn't mean you have lizard brain. Wrong. Okay. Basically the same though. Ru no! He doesn't know, ain't no way. Go lick your eyeball lizard boy. <laughs> wow, dude. Damn, man. What the frick? What the fuck? You guys want to take it easy? Okay. I've been through a harrowing two days and you're treating me like this? Am I not already punishing myself enough playing what I'm playing today? Why do you have to take swings at me as well? So you're not gonna like what happens if you keep taking swings at me, alright? Because I'm not gonna take swings at you, I'm gonna take him at Michael. I'm gonna fucking take him away. Making cash bets, tomato dies. In 12 minutes and 32 seconds to a bear. You really think I'm gonna fall like that? I'll have you know, while I was testing, I made it all the way through the first day every time. And only in one of those days, 
did a wolf jump through my door and kill me? Only in one of them. And yes, it did kill me in one bite. Okay. Because you only roamed your own backyard. And that's what I plan to continue to do! And that's what I plan to continue to do! Okay. I ain't... I ain't crazy. I made I added some stuff that makes some of the enemies harder as well and add some new enemies because I've also added ways to get away from enemies. I've added a mod that lets me climb walls like Legend of Zelda. So we're kind of evening out the playing field. I'm just like I'm just like Breath of the Wild, man. Lizard feet pads. But is there a Gilk mod? There's no Gorilla mod, so how is that possible? Fool. No Gilk? No Gilk. Okay, chat, so basically here's how we're going to do this. Okay. The permadeath world that I'm playing on is set so if I die, I will respawn 5,000 blocks away from my body. On top of that, there is no map mechanic enabled on the world I'm using. So rather than remake a map every single time, we're simply going to continue with the same world because I'm never finding my stuff again. And if I were to find my old stuff, I would simply not touch it because it's just going to save us more time to do it that way. That's just what we're going to do because it's going to save a lot more time. If you die, you're never finding your stuff again. Your stuff drop- everything on you drops from your body, and you are taken so far away, and there's no, like, real meaningful way to find your stuff again. So, it is gone. For all intents and purposes, it's gone. Tomato is dead to the first temporal storm. Says you. Says you. Says you, man. <laughs> yeah, you can doubt all you want, but you know what? You're gonna look like an idiot when I prove you wrong. Slash me looks up Temporal Storm on the wiki that he has open on another monitor. Why not simply close myself in a one by two hole? Fool. Sounds like I win. Sounds like I win. Sounds like we just go AFK. Then you get hungry. You have an inventory in this video game. <laughs> you can hold food. Don't you see? Don't you understand? I'm going to be fine. I just can't believe you guys don't fucking believe in me. What the fuck? <laughs> Does he die in the first 30 minutes? Make it the first hour. Why first 30 minutes? Make it hour. First 30 minutes, no faith. We do all believe in you. You'll perish. So you believe in me to die and pay out the bet. Dude, I'm more powerful than before. Post colonoscopy me, okay, is lighter on his feet. 
Okay, I'm lighter on my feet. Literally. I've been cleansed. Of all- all of my po- my old woes. I'm Zenkai boosted. Okay? I'm Zenkai boosting even now. All right. You know what? We're going in. People doubt me? People doubt me? I have no re- People doubt me? <laughs> Fine. Fine. Fine! Fine. You about to see what happens when you doubt me. You all about to see what happens. I'm gonna make the world. The world is gonna be named Peaceful Hermit Valley, which is funny because the, uh, again, we're playing on Wilderness Survival Difficulty. You respawn randomly within 5,000 blocks upon death. Okay. Now I'm going to increase that to 10,000. Doubters. <laughs> Doubters. Just so you know, I'm kicking up. I'm kicking it up a notch. Okay? Entire inventory disposed of upon death. True winters enabled. Block gravity enabled. Player health points. 10. Everything we're gonna do default. Out of it. World map off. Coordinate overlay off. Doesn't matter. Temporal storms every 5 to 10 days. We're all gonna die. Starting climate. Temperate. Everything's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. What's a temporal storm? <laughs> awesome Cave World is the name of this world. Awesome Cave World. How long is a day? It's more than 30 minutes, right? <laughs> Guys, don't worry, it's gonna be okay. We're spawning an awesome cave world. But what about the sky? Damn. Fucking spooky ghost looking ass motherfucker. Randomize, 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 random. Oh, there he is, dude. There he is. There's our guy. He sounds like he's gonna sound like a saxophone. Not sure why he got- he started screaming there. But he's gonna sound like, uh, he's gonna ha he's gonna be wearing, a a saxophone. The old Moss, thank you for the ten gifted subs, very kind of you. And he's- Hang on. Saxophone medium. He looks exactly like this. this. Is him? Confirm. He's gonna be a commoner. Okay. We're gonna do commoner. No positives or negatives. We're a commoner. This is how we survive. Peasant style. Normie. LOL peasant. Last thing. We're turning off the music. Or we're gonna turn it down, and we're gonna put it down to less frequent. Because I actually do need to hear what's around me, or we're dead. Okay, it's not because I don't like the music, it's because if I can't hear what's around me, I'm dead. Okay? 
and the wolf is gonna eat me. Okay, let's take a look at where we are. There's some kind of structure. I've added some mods. I'll show you the mod list later. But for now, we gotta get a, we gotta get uh, some stuff. We spawned in snow zone, which is bad. We're gonna freeze to death out here within a couple of moments. Not much chance of us surviving out here. Hello, little creature, little little beast. This is what I've added to the game in exchange for no map or anything like that. Uh, every 5,000 to 10,000 blocks, a teleporter station can appear. It can be repaired if you have the right stuff, and it'll be a means of me being able to move around the map despite not having any, like, actual landmarks. So if I got horribly lost at some point, I'd be able to salvage that situation for myself. We just need to, we need to start off by getting ourselves some flint and ideally moving out of the snow zone because really I don't feel very good about living in a snow zone. I think that would be the, we're gonna need, we're gonna need to grab this as well. That's the flint we need. Temperature does matter and we can freeze to death in this game. We want to get, we want to find a good source of water that ideally also has reeds in it. We need reeds to make bags. So for now, we move along. This is a funny tree. Kind of a weird one. Oh damn, the lighting looks really good. This is a very pretty game. It's uh, based off of Minecraft, obviously, but you'll start to see very quickly. <gasps> Worm! You. We are playing on the hardest difficulty! Motherfucker! Every moment we spend. Okay, not eating something for protein is a wasted moment. You're a fool. You are a fool. You are a child fool. You're an idiot. The fact that this is all snow really worries me. It seems like we may be in a truly, uh, like, somewhat tundra-like environment. And there's not been- there's not been any string source. This may be a wash. This character might be doomed from the start. Hang on. There's some kind of landmark. This might be the only chance we have of surviving. Clay. Some kind of cobblestone. Let's make some tools, and then we'll go from there, I guess. We're gonna carve out a fucking axe for ourselves. We're gonna make an axe. And then we're gonna make a knife and a spear. Uh, let's see, a spearhead next. This music can shut the fuck up now. I've had enough of it. I need silence. I need silence. I need silence. The music can shut the fuck up. It's gone on long enough. Hi, I'm playing on hardcore. I don't need like happy go lucky music. Like a wolf could run up to me right now and bite my head off. I need absolute focus. We don't even have food and we're already half dead. We need to survive out of here. We don't have time for this. All right, we need sticks. We need sticks. We're gonna need as many sticks as possible. All right, what's this? Birch seed? George is planted there, who cares? All right, we're gonna make a spear first and foremost. We need a way to defend ourselves if someone comes after us. All right. Keep your wits about you. At any moment, a fucking creature could show up and just rip our head off. X done. Knives. Done. Good. All right, we have the basics. 
We're gonna cut down this big ass tree so that we can make firewood and the other basics. I see something in the distance. Keep yourself focused on the task at hand. Okay, keep yourself focused on the task at hand. All right. We're gonna ditch this one. We're gonna ditch this crap. We don't need it. We just need it. I ditched it and it fell right back into my inventory. Ditch all that. We don't need it. We're leaving. What the hell is all this? A broken static translocator. If there was any kind of reeds here- Whoa, 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 whoa. How about you step back? Oh, that thing's totally gonna attack me. Uh, a scroll? Uh, contains a story in it. I don't really care. Rusty gear. Honey sulfur poultice. That heals me. I'll take some of that. It might just keep me alive. Uh, this is a crate that's closed and empty. So in order to repair this, I would need, like, actually functional gears. We're not going to be able to get anything like that anytime soon, so we're just going to leave this. It would be a cool place to make a home, or at least, like, a base camp if there were... <gasps> we need... Chat, we need reeds. We need a way to make baskets. Because it's how we get inventory space. There's some kind... I see a tower in the distance. We're gonna make our way towards it. We're gonna try to make our way towards that tower. Because again, for context. One, the survival guide still doesn't fucking pause. We need either leather, or we need some kind of... cat tails. We need a way to make a hand basket. We get cat tails from reeds. We don't have those yet. We need to find them. We need to live in a place with those, because they're also a food source. The world isn't very stable out here. Things can just fall apart. Crush me, kill me in an instant. We need to find food. Easy. Easy. I'm not after you. I'm actually after killing your baby after I've separated him from you. Really glad the dad dropped the ball on this one. Sorry, kid. Oh! 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 Yes, I noticed. Oh! 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 I, I'm missing. Oh! you and me. All right. Might as well be you. Raw meat and raw hide. Good. Good. That'll feed, that'll keep us alive. Glad none of them noticed. We need to keep moving this way. Towards a spooky castle. This could be home! We could make a home for ourselves here! We won't have baskets, but we can- we can live like this! We can live here! In the- in the tower by this altar! <laughs> and these bones! Wait, hang on. This is a lovely castle. We could li we could make a house here. We could make this safe to live in. There's bricks. We have boards. We have this ladder, which goes all the way to the top. We're gonna starve to death soon. Black brown zingot and compost. But there's supplies here. Alright? And at the end of the day... 
at the end of the day, that's something. Okay, there's seeds, there's supplies, you just need a water source near here. That's the real problem, but that's a landmark, we can use that. Is that a real water source? I think I see one. Water. It's not much and there's no reeds. But we need to find a place to settle down and start like getting supplies going. We won't have inventory, but we'll at least have some options. This is the best we got right now. Though I don't really like li I don't want to live in a place with like animals one nearby because these are bulls. They could just get angry one day and decide to like gore me. But we are starting to get hungry. We need to pick a place. These ruins seem like an option. And some of the walls will at least already be done. I think we start clearing out these trees. Tomatoes scared of herbivores gaming. Look, I'm willing to live near those bulls because I can continue to harvest their children for meat if I chase them away from the pack. Okay. We just need to clear all this foliage out. But we're gonna be hungry soon, that's the problem. We need to make ourselves- we need to make ourselves some kind of base camp. We'll have to find another way to live. While we struggle to get backpacks instead. I like the idea of living on this side, it's already mostly walled. I mean, yeah, there's some bones... ...and stuff going on, but it's mostly walled in. We just have to get rid of this grody-ass altar. Let's get rid of that. I just don't like it. We don't want- we don't want that. Okay. We need to make- we need to start making things. Alright, first things first. Let's make some firewood. 24 of this stuff. Let's drop the rest of it on the ground for now, we will come back to it. Let's gonna drop these rocks. We don't have any inventory space, so we kind of have to just work with what we got. We need to make a fire start. We make a fire so we can cook this meat. It's the only way we stay alive out here. We're going to have to harvest meat. Okay. Yes. We're going to make a fire pit right here in this clearing. For now. This is home! <laughs> this is... This is home, Jed. Look around you. This is it. Isn't that nice? This is home. We got a fire. And now, we have meat cooking. And most importantly, this place has a landmark we can see from a distance. What was that fucking sound? Oh, it was a dead creature, dead creature partially eaten. Wait, who ate it? Worry about stuff like that later. Mine now. <laughs> it's a dead fucking creature, that's my food now. Done. Next one. Eat this. Yeah, dude. We stay barely clinging to life, but cling we continue to do. We need to we need to start building a fucking perimeter. God damn it. We just what we just don't really have much space for things, huh? Because we have no bags. Okay. First character is definitely feeling like it will end up being a wash because we didn't find any reeds. We need to get leather. Which means we need to prepare hide and we need tannin. Which is made by, uh, mixing, uh... A but really just a lot of stuff in a barrel. Which means we need to make a barrel. We're not making a barrel for a while though, we need to be able to make a bronze axe. So we're not gonna have a bag until we find reeds. That's just the reality of the situation. We need a saw. 
okay? The odds of that are low. Real Sev tech hours? Look, it's not good out here, but... We had this spooky altar which we can use as part of a wall. <laughs> we will survive, even if we have to act like a total, like, doofus to do it. Okay, we got all these bricks. Maybe we can, like, use these. Maybe we can use these to make some... Where's the sun? It's just about noon out. The sun's actually super setting. We have to start worrying about this stuff. All right. We're going to move the bricks over here. Just going to place those down. We need to start building some kind of perimeter. Okay. We're going to make it out of these logs because we have a lot of logs. Just a thing. Just a small thing. We have a lot of logs. We're going to make a little hovel for ourselves. Nice. Thanks. I hate this. These will have to go. Huh. We actually get to pick them up by hand. Chat, we do need more food, though. Uh, going into this. What the fuck was that sound? Oh, it was the sound of my guy. <laughs> this counts as a wall. For the purposes of our work, that counts as a wall. Move this. It'll drop a bunch of seeds. That's okay. We're just gonna plant them. We're gonna we're gonna make a hoe. We're just gonna plant those in a minute. Drop that. We don't need it. <laughs> this is true squalor right now. We are living our worst life in hell. This area sucks. If we die, we'll restart somewhere else better. Because we just don't have bags. We can't carry things. Get this shit out of my inventory. Maybe we can eat wood. <laughs> maybe we can... Well, maybe we can eat wood or something. I think about that. Yeah. Maybe we can eat wood. Yeah, that'll do. This is like a home. All right. We're gonna pull the rest of it. No, we're just gonna leave him in there. We need to fucking drop this. Put all those down. We need to do. Wait, hang on. No, we have to. We need. We need flint. We need flint. I'm just gonna place that block. We need flint. We need flint or nothing gets any better out here. Sorry, idiot. Whoa! Uh, ow! Ow, fuck! Uh, you know how many of these healing things I got, you piece of shit? Oh! Uh, fuck off! Uh, oh, fuck away from me, what the hell's your problem? <laughs> this fucking fox is crazy, man! Oh. 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 Barely scraping by, but scrape by we continue. <sighs> scrape by we continue. To do. People used to live here. I need flint before I can do anything. I need flint. Flint! Stop barking! Thank you. Clay, that's good. Just need... Just need a little bit of... Flint is all. Just need some flint. Wow, that's some good FPS. What's up with that, Flint? 
cool, cool. I go away. Thank you. I need to make a hoe. So I can at least plant these fucking seeds. Drop all this for a second. Craft this. Oh. God, the no inventory space is insanely brutal right now. I hunger. We need to go back and cook the meat we found. Ow! My character is loud. He really makes it known that he- Ow! He really makes it known that he's in pain. Ow. Cook this meat. Ah! Can I turn that down? No. Hey, it's kind of nice though, isn't it? Something kind of relaxing about it. Ow. Good news is I can't die, I have these fucking things. Owie. I think this dirt is too powerful for me to use. Oh fucking, I have to kill this character off. Uh, there was quieter voices and I picked the loud one because I thought there was something wrong with my audio. Oh yeah, and this bush meat's not gonna cut it, chat. Look, we 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 we're gonna we're gonna chalk this one up to uh, bad seed. All right, we're gonna chalk this one up to bad seed. It's over. There's no way we fucking make it out of here. We didn't spawn in a place with reeds. We spawned in a shithole and had to walk for fucking twenty minutes. Tomato the gamba. I gave up. They win. They win. We have to do it again. I also think the game may have frozen. Bullshit, dude, I was gonna die that night, dude. I was going to die that night. It, it was over. I didn't have any inventory space or any, like, reeds to start or, like, any kind of water source. You need to have... Chat this game. Do you know what happened to humans in the middle of fucking nowhere without a water source back in the, like, olden times? They fucking died. All right? They fucking died. Because without a water source, you can't... They died. Those people would die. They died and they disappeared. All right, that's what happened to them. That's what happened to them, they died. When they were born, they looked around and they saw there was no water source and they blew their own brains out. That's what happened. With what? A gun! Stupid! Use your head. <laughs> Use your fucking head. Now this time I'm gonna pick a guy with a quiet voice, because I don't want to hear him as he starves to death, because he's gonna be starving a lot. Four days until the first temporal storm, that's cool. Sounds good. This is the longest skin confirmation I've ever- No fucking way I spawned in an even shittier fucking area! Wow, dude. We're gonna- Guys, we're gonna be okay! Look at how much fucking water there is! <laughs> Maybe I can like... Hello. You can't build, no privilege to build or claim blocks. Well, can I break your fucking house? No. God damn it. Two times now. Uh, every time I tested before, I would spawn in a lovely place. Like a lovely place. <gasps> finished house, finished house, finished house, finished house. Just a finished house, just a full house. That's ours now. That's our property now. I claim that. Hang on. First of all, it's a lot of flex. It's 
Second of all, I live here now. This is my house. Brother, I found it fair and square. Fuck you. This right here? This is my clothes. Why is everything lagging? Like, I pressed tab and it actually froze my game. It crashed my g Is that gonna be a repeating thing, sir? Yeah, I'll be taking this clothes. Thanks, asshole. Get me out here. I don't need the rusty gears. I don't think the quartz is gonna matter. I don't care about the scroll. Dude, I just need to see fucking... I just need to see cattails. Like, I... I, I don't have the flint to harvest that right now, man. We need to find cattails and none of this matters. I swear to God, I will kill myself again and the doubters will be fed. So well. I swear to God. Look, voice box would back me up, dude. I haven't played anywhere near as much Vintage Story as him, but like we we need we need the we need that. We need a water source with like that resource in it, or we can't really do much. We need reeds. Oh uh, what the fucking Christ, that's just a hole. Why do I keep spawning in snow zones, man? The temporal storm comes and I have nothing to show for it. Not even berry bushes. <gasps> Hello. But do fish spawn? in this water, because that'd be the only other option. I don't see any reeds, but if fish spawn, we can work with that. Try to see here. I'm sinking. <sighs> I'm not seeing any fish. I'm not seeing any fish at all. It's kind of just a bad scene out here. All right, if I haven't collected or built anything and I choose to off myself because the biome I'm spawning in is one that I am not prepared to do this in, uh, we are not gonna pay that out. We're just gonna continue to have that follow through to the next life. Because uh, I have been given two cursed fucking cold seeds. And I fell into the darkness. I'm still alive. I'm still alive. I'm in some kind of shadow realm. I can see very... I can... I found a chest with some uh, coal in it. Wow, it's like a really nice place if you could see it. I found a witch's hat. People used to live down here. <laughs> the fuck am I? Ugh. Where the hell are we? Where the hell is this place? Who pants? bro pants bro dude no fucking way dude where does my scarf go very good pants on we're never gonna get out of here chat we just keep going deeper and deeper Hey. No. 
El diablo. El diablo. Oh. I think I see light back there. I think I see actual light over here. No. Okay, I want to die and respawn now. I want. All right, so I want to die and respawn now. I want to die and get the uh, get the biome with uh, temperate climate. This time, we're gonna spawn some. Yo! We got reed, baby. We got cranberry bushes, baby. We'll be taking those. See what I mean, chat? <laughs> See what I mean? See, the problem is now I still spawn like disadvantaged because I'm now half uh, halfway through the day. So uh, I kind of have to move a little bit faster now. But at the very least we have reeds. I need my actual flint though to harvest them. We're gonna need to find flint fast. And ideally, the promised land. Chat, the promised land, it's right there! This is it. Hop. Flint two. Got it. Knife right away. Knife right away. Make a knife right away. I need my fucking rock out to break anything. We gotta move way faster now because the sun's gonna set faster. We need to move a lot faster. Okay, knife. Done. Close that. We need stick. Two stick. Okay. We're gonna break these, and we're also gonna take the roots beneath them. Because we can eat those for food. We need all of it. Well, I'm going gamer mode. It's not gonna feed us well, but if we grab enough of them, it will feed us for a while. Some of these are just normal rocks. We need the flint ones. It'll cover us for the day, and that's the main thing, is that we want to harvest fish from the lake there. We just need to, we just need to, we just need to get a, get our bearings. All right. We need 10 per bag, 10 per inventory expansion of the reeds. Ideally, the faster we get all that, the better everything goes for the entire game, especially early game. So we are just really going to pick up everything from this lake, this little one here. Huge. Is now this right here changes everything, chat. It really does. All right, that's two. Two bags, six new inventory slots. And 20 cattail roots we can eat later. We just needed, dude, I'm like, that's why I needed to reset. Like, we might still die out here, but we have a way better chance of living in a place with, like, reeds. You, like, you just don't have food early game if you don't have, like, some really easy plants growing. I don't know how the fuck anyone would make it in, like, you have to just hunt. 
All right, that's everything harvested, almost. 30 reeds. 31. Okay. We can get our last bag while we're out there. Uh, grab this. Grab Wait! That's gonna be really good for bait, brother. This is the promised land, Chad. We made it. We're breaking every berry bush we see so we can relocate them next to our house, wherever we choose to move. And considering there's a fully finished block here in the water, isolated from animals and creatures. Why, I mean, this feels like the perfect place to live. Build a little bridge out. This is nice. This is what we're going to do. That's a base. All right. Let's make our tools. And it's nice and clear, so things likely won't be able to sneak up on me as fast. Okay. Axe. I move all this into my... Just want to move everything off of my, like, bar. Seems like a nice place to settle. It's a swamp, but it's my swamp. The sun's gonna set soon, so we have to move faster. Okay. I've really thought more sticks would fall from that. It's fine, we'll get some from this shrub. I think I can just break with anything. We will live. Okay. Uh, next thing. We want a shovel. I need something to, like, put down the ground of this place. Shovel. Also, dirt's just... Gonna be the easiest thing to use as walls. Okay. Because I want to use all the wood I have for, um... I want to use every single wood for firewood right now. Cow parsley? I don't know what cow parsley fucking is. I, don't, I also don't know what the fuck to do with eagle fern. But I know I need a lot of grass. Because I need to make a bed ASAP. We don't want to be out at night. Web, Grab it. Okay, where's my berries? Uh... Okay, well, these things burn. That's cool, I guess. Kind of useless, though. Berry bushes. Berry bushes. I don't think I want to have a land bridge right now into this. I think I just want it to be water so that nothing can easily get to me. Okay, I'm gonna make a- I'm gonna make a little- a little thing. Just so we have a fire ready to go when the sun sets. Okay. All of the wood. Okay. Put the rest in there. Let's make a... Sorry, I'm like going- I'm going like gamer mode right now. I'm trying to make sure I have everything all set up. Cow parsley. That's also a burn, but I don't really care about that right now. So I'm starting to already set. We need to secure this place so things can't just walk in. You need more dirt. A 
It'll also be good to have all this flattened so stuff we can see stuff on like the coast. And then tomorrow we start panning for copper. Then tomorrow the madness begins. Okay. Should be enough. Fortunately, all these blocks, like, break really easily. So I can just clean this up really quickly. We're gonna start the fire. And then start cooking some cattail. Dude, open my inventory. Okay. 31 cooked cattail. We will live. What's wrong with you? I think that's just the sound of it heating up. That or this water is a problem. I'm gonna get rid of it just to be safe. Rain. I do need to make a covering for this place still. That's dirt. You can't just use dirt, you stupid idiot. You gotta use the wood for that. You freaking nitwit. That's the last thing we need wood for. What the fuck is that? Crabs. We get crabs out here. I'm trying to be cool. I don't want to antagonize that deer or that, that, that goat. We get crabs out here, chat. Yeah, it is fucking raining. Of course it is. We don't need the whole thing covered immediately. We just need to cover the fucking fire before it goes out and wastes my time. Dude, stop. Okay. This is home, Chad. We live like this. We live like this. This is... Bro, how you even fall like that, man? <laughs> Bro, how you even do that? Okay, well... I'm gonna carve this out to make a door in a minute. But first, I need to eat. So, yeah. It's not much, chat, but it is food. It is food. We need more logs, though. We're gonna need more logs. This place needs to be secured before they come. The creatures. One bite from a dog right now could instantly kill me. A, gu a crab snipping at my leg? Death on sight. Did you hear that? We head to the safety of our... of our tower. Here's the thing. I want to break this next because we are going to make a door, a really shitty door, but it is going to be a door. Okay, I can't break that. That's too strong, but this brick I can break. So we're going to move it over one. One of them is too powerful for me. The other one is not. How you make a door. A really shit door. We live like this. 
This is how we live. Every once in a while, when you close it, it'll just break. Which is like a feature. It's a feature of it. I don't know if I grabbed enough dry grass to finish things. But either way, I need to eat more. So for now, that's priority one. We will live. Oops. Okay, I need to go back out. I need to cut down some more grass. I need enough to make uh, some hay. So much of this is like not stuff I need. And I'm afraid to venture too far from my tower. What if a wolf came by? You know? Okay, we have enough now. Wolf? Yeah, a wolf. A creature of the night. Okay. Hang on, I need to check the perimeter for if they can just climb in. I need to do a lap around, make sure nothing can just climb in. I also need to make some more firewood. So far, I'm not seeing any breaches. It doesn't look to me that it's very- aside from right there, which is easily solved. <laughs> we are somewhat secure. Unless something spawns on the roof. Squalor core. It is what it is. Okay. We even have a nice hole to huck. We even have a nice roof hole that we can use to huck garbage we don't want out of the house. Isn't that nice? Whoa, look! Look, dude! A shooting star! I wish for uh, to catch a fish tomorrow. Whoa, dude! Another one! Whoa, dude! An another one! Okay, they're starting to get a little bit... Okay, now it's like... Getting a little much. Why does it always go sideways, dude? I just want a roof. Is that too much to ask? Whoa, dude! Okay. Here we go. Check this one out. First of all, I still got more trash I'd like not in my house. That was not the way to do it. Wait, I can climb up things. I forgot. I'm like a skilled climber. Oh, wait. I need to have an empty hand to be a skilled climber. It lost. Okay, it's not much chat, but it is home. And now, we even have a bed. Look at this. Directly beneath the water. Look at this. Look at this! Can monsters climb? Shut up. If you know what's good for you, you won't say anything dumb like that again. Stack our firewood right here. This is the life, chat. This really is. We're gonna spend some time right now figuring out what we're gonna do tomorrow. Because we still have- we're still in like the phase of like needing to like, you know, take care of ourselves. Stuff's bad out here. 
So here's the situation. Open survival guide. Guides. We just need to ask them about fish. Specifically primitive survival. Which is a mod that allows me to primitively survive. We could use sticks and cordage to build fish baskets and place them in the water to start fishing. We have worms. We can also make wire traps. Also easy. Limb line or a trot line. Choose any suitable block like a tree, a block of dirt, and place a stake in the ground next to a water source. Or trot line, place another suitable block directly across the water from it with the cordage in your active inventory slot. Take one, target one stake block. Yeah, this makes sense to me. We're gonna make the wire trap one because that one seems easiest. That one seems like I have to do the least work for that. We're gonna do wire trap. Okay. I think we could all agree wire trap is the most important one. We're gonna make a wire trap. Use stakes to build a fenced in area in the water or at the edge of the water with an open block of water in the middle. And right click on the far side. Okay, so we just need to make some stakes. Uh, let's see. Steak. Dude, easy, dude. We can make that right now, dude. If I own sticks, I need to make more stuff anyways, but we can start the process. We just don't have enough sticks or enough durability on my knife. But that's okay. Chat, any time that we're sleeping is time that we're burning calories, like not doing anything. So tonight we're gonna spend crafting some things. We need to be careful out here. The world is against us. Okay, we'll have those for later now. I don't need water, Lily. Guys, it's just a lot of garbage I don't need out here. Huh? My door broke. <gasps> I'm hearing- I'm actually hearing a creature outside! I need the light again. I'm going to sleep. Nah, man, we're sleeping, man. <gasps> it's fucking raining still. But the coast is clear outside. I'm not seeing anything weird. Did you have more snacks? Okay. Time to start work. We need sticks. And I also need a spear. There's still a couple things we need to take care of today. The rain sucks. Temporal stability. I don't have time to worry about every part of my life. I'm afraid to attack that crab <laughs> without a spear. Okay, I am. making a basket would be good. I really can't believe the survival guide doesn't pause the game when you're in it, by the way. Like, I think some kind of bag. I think we might want to make some kind of reed basket that we can use to uh, hold things like actual items. There would just be more reeds. We don't have to break the roots of the reeds, by the way. That's not necessary. So, like, we don't have to destroy our house. Or, like, destroy, like, the, our, like, reed supply. Which is cool. Okay. Make another knife. Fire's gone out. That's okay now. 
I can see. God, I just need a play. I just need like more inventory space. But these fucking ferns, dude. These fucking ferns. Wow, isn't that something? Survival guide pauses game, but not pixels for some reason. I would need to see something moving to, like, believe that. I would have to see something moving to believe you. Jump. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah, chat? Hey, chat. Are you guys fucking sure when you say your stupid shit? Huh, it looks like they're moving, you fucking goon. Embarrassing. I'm gonna get enough of these to make my last bag quick. Chat, you know what fucking winked me out about this lake? I'm, uh... Not seeing any fucking fish in it. So far. The latest update said they made it pause, Pepe Hands. You have to toggle it. Okay. I'm uh, looking around for that toggle. In the book, you think? I'm sorry, did I untick the pause? And it's... Now it pauses. So you're telling me every time that I want to do this, I have to pause it like that. Every time. Every time. Apologize right now? No. Because it doesn't work right. <laughs> no, because it doesn't work. That's, that's trash. That's worthless to me. I need to make armor out of firewood, dry grass. We need clothes. And I need more wood too. This is the last tree of our valley. Why am I hearing like wolves? It do if it doesn't remember to stay paused, it's, it's useless. Everything's gonna be fine. We're gonna we're gonna stabilize as soon as we've collected this year wood and gotten our backpack done. Did I just see a living thing next to me? The fuck was that? I thought I saw something, but that's not possible. I thought I saw like a like a creature with like white fur. Okay. We have the highest amount of inventory space we can have. Current. Next step. God, you really don't get any sticks unless you're breaking the leaves, huh? They don't just, like, fall as much as... What the fuck? Hello. Don't fight me. Ah, I didn't know the last time I fought a fox. It wasn't worth it. Stick, sticks, 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 sticks. Okay. Is that a raccoon? Okay. We got like five of these. We're gonna try to make one like right here. We're just gonna see how that plays out. 
It's in the water, it's free! Nowhere to run, dude, it's my house. Sorry, dude. It, it, I, I gotta live out here, man. My poor fucking inventory. We're gonna grab that in a second. Dude, please! There's no inventory, it's always fucking raining! <laughs> my house sucks and my temporal stability is falling and I think my character's starting to get cold, bro! I need so much firewood. We're gonna make a full stack of this. So we have it. Now the rest of it is gonna be made in the clothes. We need clothes. I'm sorry. Do I need more of this? I do. Okay, Jack, good news. We have clothes on now. We have armor. Soggy fire. It's yeah. It's made out. Yeah, it's made out of fucking wood. Okay. I'm gonna eat these berries. I don't want them to spoil. I feel like the roots are gonna last longer. Yeah, those last for nine days. Yeah, we're gonna let those. We're gonna keep those in our inventory. This is the life, living in absolute- I would call it absolute squalor. That rat- that fucking raccoon is completely fucking dead. Oh, this is a good place to put the fish thing. How big of one of these things can I make? Because this is already like kind of carved out for me. Hang on, consult the unpaused, paused thing. Let's see here, let's see here. <clears throat> you may have better luck fishing if you set up a limb line. Wait, alternatively, use simple stakes to make a wire trap. To do so, use the stake to build a fenced in area in the water or at the edge of the water with an open block of water in the middle of it. Then right click on the far side of the fenced area. The stake. Okay. Is this too big for this? I think I need a smaller area. Hang on, I'm gonna make like a small thing right here to figure out what the fuck this, this is. One by two or one by three. Well then right here should be fine. I am deeply confused. Uh, cause it looked like I did. Right click. I did. Chat. I did. I, d I did everything. It has to be even on both sides. There we go. So this is a this is the M-shaped wire trap. There we go. It could potentially catch me some some fish. Now that I know how it works, we're gonna move it. Because it definitely doesn't need to be this far from my house. We can make these very cheaply and put them all 
much closer. Matter of fact, I can put one uh, right here. Or so I believe. Yes. Okay. We get stronger every day. Every day we grow in power. And now we have wire traps. Will they? Sure my door just broke right off the hinges again. Sure the roof isn't done. Sure that sure basically every moment of my life I'm half I'm halfway to tears. But that's okay. Sure there's no trees growing anymore in order to get wood I have to walk like 50 minutes away. None of that fucking matters. Sure the fucking rain causes the game to actually drop FPS. And it's starting to frustrate me because it seems like it'll never stop raining. But you know who else thought it would never stop raining? Probably some of our ancestors at some point. Lower particles helps a lot. Seventy percent. This will finish our roof at last. We need to make a- we need to start making inventory, like, chests. And we need to start panning some things. Cool, my axe broke. <laughs> it's okay, we'll just make a new one. It only cut half of the tree. When are we gonna look for copper? Once I feel like I'm not gonna starve to death and die. Is the realistic answer. So, yeah. Hang on. What else can I make? Pause. With cattails. Hand basket, crude shield, empty B. Empty B, Nate. I don't need that. Horsetail poultice from horsetail and cattail. We haven't seen any of that. Reed basket. Seems like we want to start making reed baskets to hold things. We already have reeds sitting around. We're not going to take any of the cattails or any of the roots, but, uh. Seems like it might be in our best interest to start investing in inventory storage. Because I'm already running out of space again. And then... It's time to start panning for gold, Chet. After that, it's time to start panning for gold. Fucking knife broke again. We're gonna start panning for gold. See, we're lucky we haven't seen any creatures. Basket obtained. We have true storage now. We still don't have a roof. We should probably finish that. But we need clay really to do much more. Do you guys think a fish will ever come here? I hope so. That's the basket. Yes! <laughs> yes! Worms. Wait, of course! Okay, that's just me eating the worm. I can't bait the wire trap. Wire trap can't be baited, I'm just carrying around worms. But they never spoil. So the worms are going in. We're evolving. Navigator Black, thanks for the five gifted subs. We're becoming stronger every day. <laughs> I live like this though still. To this day, 
We live like this. But hey, you know? These water lilies don't even need to be in my inventory. These fucking pl Okay, chat. Where's the trash? There's God, there's too much random items in this game. There has to be like a trash button. Some kind of garbage thing I can use to like throw out items I do not care about because I do not care about these. I just don't. The water is my garbage. Yeah, I guess. You know, I could also just do this. I'm sorry, where did they just go? Oh. Because these technically burn. So if I just light this fire now, I can burn them as fuel. Is it safe to be having all my firewood that close? Also, this is taking a while. You guys think it doesn't like the soggy lily pads? you now I take them away burn how long is this dead body gonna be here can I like hang up my shovel hell yeah I can nice we'll leave that shovel there I don't need it right now We need to get more wood. I want more of a stockpile. I also want to start making charcoal. Because we are going to need that. Time to start taking care of ourselves and looking to the future. So far, the fishing situation not yielding much. Don't know if fish even live in this lake. Haven't seen one that's alive. You know, that is a fucking concern we will need to cover. I might need to start farming. We should probably make like a hoe and start farming. Because I I was counting on fishing. But I haven't seen one. Don't hold your breath. You really think it's going to be that bad? Dude thinks he can get a fish. Ain't no way. You all see! Laugh it up! Fish love the rain. And if I have to unger, so be it. If I have to pull out this spear and kill things like a psycho, then fine. I'll manually fish. Any minute now, this tree's gonna fall over, I swear. Any minute now, this tree's gonna fall right over. Oh, yeah. All right, chat. We're going to start some charcoal. It's about time. After I, fin after I finish the fucking roof. All right? I'm not that dumb. After I finish the roof, we're going to do that. Fish? Wow, a plane. <laughs> going overhead. Wow, cool. <laughs> this 
fucking house sucks so bad. Home sweet home. I actually am gonna plug up these holes with like real wood at least. I can't have it the way it is. I just can't. There. House is, these are just real windows. Okay, that's the point of them. All right, that's why they exist. The lily pads literally didn't burn. Back where you came from. The, the uh, dirt is also kind of a situation. I had to turn down more of these particle effects, dude, literally. Okay. There's just so many particulates. All right, chat. All this wood being turned into charcoal. Follow me. We're about to get, get this done thing started. This year will be the charcoal hole. Yep. We just gotta dig a big hole and fill it up with wood. Yep. Yes, sir. Oh, I hate that. I hate this new mechanic of things falling. Why? Why does that happen? Oh, hog. Oh, no. I mean, I can't fight them. And they're gonna be near the charcoal. Maybe they'll be cool and not attack me. Actual feral hogs. Okay, I might have made this a little too big. Probably could have done a couple less. Yeah, we're gonna need to cut down another tree. Which means I'm gonna need more flint on top of it. Dude, come on. Pull, pull out the rock. Okay. Tonight, chat, we're gonna pan. Okay. Tonight, we're gonna pan for, uh, for, for iron. All right. Bumbo Bumberson, thanks for the 5,000 bits. Really glad to see you give this game another shot. My best friend and I love it. It can be a little tedious, but I kind of like the I kind of find the tedium re relaxing. Dude, I played Sevtech. All right, tedium's my middle name. I love it when games make me miserable the whole time. Unapologetically. Thanks for the 5,000 bits. We're gonna get rid of all these small birch logs or trees. Just clear out this area for farmland, I think. We need this place clear. Plus, I don't want any like creatures to be hiding around. Look at this. You guys think maybe there's fish inside the wire trap? Will it ever stop raining though? Can someone tell me that? Do I just live in rain zone? Oysters. Wait. Is that, is that edible? Is that an edible, uh? That they're an edible, uh, mushroom? Cause that's not an oyster, that's a mushroom. That looks like mushrooms for some reason. It says plant. 
So I think that's actually like a mushroom named a white oyster. The pig is now hanging out directly next to the fucking zone. Okay, we're gonna clean this up a little bit more. Specifically using the low... Yeah, that's what I wanted you to do anyways, so you're just kind of helping me out. This will work anyways. It doesn't need to be a 3x3, three three, right? Your player inventory will tell you the average rainfall of the area. Very common. Hey, at least the at least the uh the crops will be good. At least the crops will be really nice. Chat. I don't need this to be centered, right? I can just put the fire down, light it, and then cover it. Which now I need a fucking roof to do that! <laughs> I'm gonna need a roof to do it! Cause I can't light one here because there's water over it! Actual fucking like bozo moment Like real bozo hours Maybe it'll be okay Several days left before ready to mate I just don't want like an actual hog to come here. That's like a that's not an aggressive hog. But I'm worried about an aggressive- I'm worried about them deciding that- oh, oh, oh. If this starts smoking, then it's working. Alright, we got charcoal. Being made. Dude, it's so bad because the rain's actually dropping the FPS of this game. I wonder if there's a mod for that. Because there's tons of mods for this game. I wonder if there's a mod for like, disable, uh, like the entirety of the rain. Forever. You know what I mean? Mm. I like rain. Yeah, I mean, I liked it until it started, like, causing particles to be a constant thing for the rest of my life. You know what I mean? Is what, is what, because it's actually dropping the FPS constantly. I have no solution to that. Like, I, like, it actually is, like, ruining the stream to me. I need to, like, not be here. I haven't built anything that's so bad that I can't, like, move, but, like, biomes in this game are fucking huge. Biomes in this game are so big. It may not be noticeable for you guys because of the FPS I stream to you at, but for me, it's, like, driving me crazy. I need this out of my inventory. Sure. Just put them here. Just put them on the roof. Now, at least we have a nice house. We're gonna starve soon. I have to eat this walnut. I'm gonna eat this fucking white oyster. There's no way it's gonna kill me. It was healthy. You gotta fuck off! You know what? They're in the middle of the goddamn lake. I can take them right now. They're basically drowning themselves. I have mobility advantage. <laughs> They're running. <laughs> oh my god. It's so... Dude. I guess I have to turn off all particles. Dude, it's so bad. I can't believe how bad it is. This fucking rain. I've turned off the rain and it's still really bad. What's causing this FPS to go down? You could also have a memory leak. You think? Should I like restart? Oh yeah, when I restarted the game earlier, chat, remember? It was oh my god. When I restarted it earlier, I was having like the game freeze up while I was in my inventory. It might be worth restarting. Fuck. 
fucking door. Hey, at least we got a lot of food. I guess I'm gonna I'm gonna save the world and restart it. I'm gonna restart the game. See if that fixes the uh the issue we're dealing with here. Although this save is taking okay. Give me a minute. Pretty sure it's the mod that adds ruins to every biome that aren't vanilla. You think that you think that it's like just that that's causing all of the lag? Like just blocks? I'd believe like it being the particles or something or like a memory leak. It's a schematic issue I was reading about. Slowly blinks eyes in amount of work that I've put in already while playing. Which one would that even be? That would have been the Better Ruins mod. Well, let me ask you the Better Ruins mod. If I see outrage in the comments, I'm gonna fucking scream. I'm not seeing anything that's like, hey, this is breaking my game in the responses to it. They were talking about it on the Discord. Well, let's see if this fixes it, yeah. Let's see if this fixes the problem. Because otherwise, we kind of do need to... That's going to be like a permanent issue that'll never go away. <laughs> Stuff seems better. I'm going to drop the SSAO and the shadows down a little. I'm going to turn back up part of it. This seems much better. The SSAO and shadows turning down helped quite a bit. Yeah, we're much more stable now. Okay, cool. Uh, all right. Uh, we are going to need to cook food, which is fine. We have a lot of meat now. I kind of want to figure out how to, I kind of want to dry this, but I don't have any salt. Stuff's gonna start spoiling soon. Do need to cook it somehow. Setting, no survival guide. Guides, pause the game. Now how the, now how about, how about this game tells me how to, uh... If you've got some red meat or bush meat, cut it up and make, to ra make raw red meat jerky. Okay. Yeah, we'll make all this into fucking jerky. Oh, hell yeah. You can cook it if you're getting anxious. No, no. I just need a place to, like, leave it. <laughs> There's gotta be, like, a way that I can, like, dangle all this on, like, a fucking rope or something. I know we can make shelves and stuff, but I needed, like, a saw to do that before. Hang on. Survival guide. This is when the game starts to, like, really pick up, is once you start having, like... ...stuff. There, which mod was it that added that? Hold up. It would have been... Culinary Artillery, I think. Meat rack. There we go. Need a meat rack. Damn it! It's still gonna take boards and copper. Which means either way, we're gonna need a saw. Which means we're gonna need to make a saw blade, which means we need copper, which means I need to get smithing. I've already started the charcoal part of it, but we need clay, which I need to go find. 
There's always something. But you know what, chat? You know what we can do right now? Against all odds? We can dump all this jerky in there and leave it there. And forget about it. And now... Okay. Follow this one. I say as I also look up how to do it. Nope. <laughs> nope, not that. Nope. This one. Wooden pan. So that we can pan for ores. We just need a wooden pan and either gravel. We just need, we just need the gravel. Sand or bony soil. I already have the log I need. All we need to do is cut it up. Sweet. Now this is really gonna change everything. I think we need to have the gravel in our inventory. I don't think we can do it like, uh... That raccoon needs to go away. Oh, yeah, we need to actually have it. I don't know if muddy gravel works, though. I think muddy gravel might be the one you're not able to. Uh, but that's okay, because there's sand right here. We're gonna give this a test run. I don't like being out here at night, though, is the problem. Dude, this reset! The fuck? I don't see anything. Yeah, it's dark. Okay, it's dark out here. Fuck! <laughs> My door! Hang on, I'm gonna turn up the brightness a tiny bit for you guys. There we go. I should up a little. Not a lot, but it'll help you a little. Okay guys, let's get to panning for some ore. We're gonna get gold. We're going to get gold, dude. It's still not working, bro. I do not think bauxite sand counts, either. I think we need a different kind of sand still. Hang on, I'm going to consult the survival guide. You need a wooden pan water stand, either gravel, sand gravel or bony so soil. None of this seems to make it... It does not look like uh, you have to right-click on the sand with the pan. Is that true? Oh! Well, I'm not doing this in the dead of fucking night. <laughs> well, I'm not doing that like that. All right. Onions. I need to fucking... I need a hoe. But I don't have any flint. These are curing. They'll be done when I wake up. Wait, I can eat this fat! <laughs> oh. Oh, hell yeah. Ugh. Ugh. I awaken, I am hungry, but my jerky is done. It's not a lot, but I do think it's more than I would have gotten from just eating it as well as is. And it's gonna last a lot longer, so we're gonna leave those in there. We're gonna try to focus on eating other foods. How do I get him? Gotcha, you motherfucker! That's a whole pike, baby! How do I... Meow, you're fucked. 
What is this? Fish eggs, raw. <laughs> I am a disgusting freak. <laughs> oh. Wait, shit! For the first time ever, it's not raining! Bro! Everything's starting to come together! Can I make fish jerky? No. Oh. That's dinner. That there is dinner, all right. That keeps for eight days at a time. So I'm gonna line my entire house with these steaks and really just have a lot of fish coming around, I think. Uh, yep. I keep thinking my spear is my knife. Yep. Yeah, we're gonna do the uh, full house-wide circle of fish. We got, it paid off for us one time and that's as many times as I need to believe that it's the only option for me. So, um... <laughs> now, here we fucking go. I'm about to go crazy mode. <laughs> Welcome to my complex. This is also going to serve as the bridge. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, this is gonna do just nicely. Yep. We can move these ones for now. We just work off of cubes. We work off of cubes. I actually can't get into my... You can't climb these, uh, which isn't good. This feels wrong. Can this raccoon get the fuck out of here? Oh, it's because I didn't take that. Now it's bones. In time, these pelts will all be collected. Okay. <laughs> we we live in squalor. We knew this would happen. We knew this would happen. But it's time to start panning for resources. Right? Like, we know this is how it's going to have to be. Oops, I just deleted all of that sand. Anything? Nothing. Anything? <gasps> Metal scraps. I don't think that does anything for me. Is that a house right there? Like right there on my crosshair? Does that look like a house to you guys? One out of 40 copper pog. And that's exactly how we do it, baby. And it's cool because all this is going to be made space for like more fish capturing units. Five, 20 pieces smell into one copper ingot. <laughs> but what about this? What do I do about the metal scrap? Surely we have something we can do with that. Oh, I should kill those pig babies. Hang on, I gotta go do that. I also need to, like, make that hoe still. Leave this here. And that. What the fuck? Dude. I, they, their mother is dead. They'll die on their own with or without me getting involved. Dead hair. It's partially eaten by another creature. Well, now it's going to be fully eaten the rest of the way by me, Tomato Gaming. Fuck. <laughs> that looked like fully eaten, game. Just so we're on the same page going forward. That was, uh, that appeared to be fully eaten. Looking at the, uh, crap, 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 crap. Oh, fuck. It's, a, it's like an actual, like... It's a crab that likes living in the grass. I'm afraid to piss off this, this, this majestic creature, or he might just, like, fucking hit me really hard with his horns. I lost the crab. Crab's gone. 
Okay, well, next step is I need... We need to find clay. We're gonna need clay. So we're gonna make a second shovel. I'm gonna go grab my original one. Actually, I'll just leave it in there. It's gonna break anyways. We'll just throw it out. We also need more sticks. Let's leave these here. Fuck that. We don't like that one. We don't like those two. We don't like those two sticks. Oh, that was really easy. Okay, we found clay. I see a stick now. Look at how stupid my guy looks. Flailing around. Alright. Blue clay. The charcoal is going to be done soon, too. Oh yeah, we're gonna grab, we're gonna grab like two stacks of this so I don't have to, I mean, then again, uh, it's really close, turns out. So I'm not sure why it even matters. Let's grab some and then come back later. Yeah, 64 sounds good. At least I'll always have a good idea of where my house is. Hang on, before I go any farther back home, one really dumb move. Really stupid. They didn't even give me any meat. Because it was a baby. It's okay, chat. I was leveling my melee skill. Why are there so many crabs out here? Can I eat these? gotta be able to. You gotta be able to. Keep your wits about you. We don't know what's up here. in it to use though copper spearhead whoa that's uh that's better than what I had I didn't even realize I had that yeah you need to start keeping my hand open here <laughs> <laughs> grains oh. yeah dude yeah dude useless they say you're a fool a short-sighted a short-sighted fool no less These mushrooms will sustain our people for many a fortnight. Fortnight? Come along. We have more work to do. Dude, we're kind of stabilizing. It's gonna really be a bummer when we get insted by like a creature that I've never seen before on day four when the uh, temporal uh, storm comes, which is I think tomorrow.
That's gonna really, really bring me down. I'm scared now. Well, Chad, all we need to do is have enough food prepared, okay, that we immediately, okay, can just hide in a one by two hole and eat jerky until it's gone. That's not hard. That's what we're going to do. That is the plan. Okay. <gasps> oh, oh, dude! Dude! This is big! This strat is paying off so hard! Okay, all red meats now are made into jerky. All red meats are made into jerky. All red meats, jerky. Because these last for 30 days or so. Oh yeah. Did I ever make that hoe I kept talking about making for hours? No, I just kept the... But is this safe to eat raw? I need more fucking reed baskets, dude. I really do. I really do. Oh. Wait. I don't even care about what you are. Get out of here. Don't light anything on fire. I just want to leave this on the ground. Yeah, we really do need, uh, need more baskets. We currently have six cattails. We would need more to do anything. We might as well harvest the ones we see. We are going to need the space. Dog barking, dog barking, dog barking. Has he died yet? He gave up two times. Gave up? The game defeated me. That was, there was no giving up. You act, you, you, you act like there was even a chance of survival in any of those. The game won. How, how dare you? I'll punish that person. I, ch moderators, I want that person punished immediately. Thank you. I'm, uh, I'm having my, uh, I'm going through my psycho arc. <laughs> Wait, you can make fishing hooks out of flint? I thought you couldn't. Well, well, well. Wait, why would I care? I already have the most effective way of fishing. I don't need a different situation. We're fine. I'm- I'm happy with what I have. At one point, I may have desired a better situation. Now I know it's bullshit. I'm gonna stick this spear into the ground here as like, almost like a kind of like, warning. That like, if you approach, you're gonna regret it. Whoa! Yeah, nice. Okay. Oh, I picked it up. Yeah, there we go. I'll have it, like, stuck to the fucking wall of my house. Was that my copper one? God damn it! <laughs> it's fine, I can climb. No, that's actually a good place, so I always know where my, my, my spears are, my spares. Oh, I can put him back! <laughs> Hello, little blue gill. I need more knives. I need more knives again. Hello, little blue gill. You're going to be devoured by me. You will sustain my people. 
for hours to come. Isn't what an honor, you know? We're gonna need more uh, reeds. We're going to need yet more reeds, I believe. Oh, we need four more reeds, and then we can make another bag. And then we'll really be cooking with gas. Crab! Wait, I have so much food now. I don't care about the crab anymore. Let them live their lives. Let them crab around. You could eat whole? I don't want to eat them whole. You guys are sick. Cook and eat whole. I want to I want to prepare them in a reasonable way. Besides, what it looks like I made more fish than the entire body mass of the creature. And these will stack. You're just scared of how powerful I'm getting. Yeah, I can tell. It's okay to be scared of how powerful I'm becoming. It makes sense. I need to hoe my lawn. I'm sorry, how do I do that? Uh, this is, there it is. This is the soil, that was nothing before. This is actual soil. This rock is too powerful. Now I can finally grow my onions. Mm-hmm. What a life. What a life we live out here. I really hope some kind of horrible eldritch storm doesn't show up and fucking kill us. That would be, uh, fucking, that would be cringe if that were to happen to me. Yeah, no, it's definitely easier just to do it like this, because these will all process down to the same fillets. Just do them all at the same time. Alright. Next pack of fish, come on in. I'm gonna need more wood soon. We do kind of need to go get more wood. We're gonna start a fire. And then we're gonna go get some more wood. I do reckon. There it is. There it is. Whip up those fillets. And while that's happening, let's go on over to a tree and go get that thing. Grow. It's growing 98% of its 100%. It's kind of pissing me off. Like... After how much work I've put into taking care of you, giving you the, like, the life you deserve and you treat me like this. Grow faster. How dare you disrespect all of the, all, ow! Oh, I'm starving. Damn it. My harmonica is harmonicking. <laughs> It's not a lot of food, but if we exponentially grow our fish network by 80 times, 
Thank God we'll be so powerful. Imagine a whole sea of fish cubes. Um, think about it with me. Use your head. Um, actually, it's a lake. Dude, I cringed. Dude, I cringed in real life. He said it. He said that. Hello. Do you have eggs? Oh. Sorry, idiot. Ripozo, dude. Can I make jerky out of chicken? Nah. Damn, I have to actually cook that. Dude, honestly, it's really nice because basically something enters the water, it's in my kill zone. I swim faster than most things in the water. From how it's looked so far. So, I'm just kind of like, living my best life out here. I need sticks. Please. More sticks, I'm so hungry. More sticks. Ten. That's another couple blocks of fish nets. You know that temporal storm's coming, chat. I would even describe it as fast approaching. And all of you seem really calm. It's as if you aren't aware of how much danger we're- <laughs> Free range fish. Not to be confused with any of the other fish I've obtained in my journeys. I just don't care about that dirt. Should I start making the safety cube? Probably. I have the coal. I need to start taking care of that, but it's just like... There's always more food to do. That's a raccoon. I think the storm comes tomorrow. Possibly even right now. I don't know, stuff's looking pretty ominous. I'm also hearing like a kind of ambience that I don't like and it's kind of wigging me out. Y'all hear that? There's like a kind of... Wind? Temporal wind. That's not possible. There's no such thing. There's, there's no such thing. Temporal wind. There's no such thing. Bets on the storm killing us.
unlikely. Although I am going to be smart and start holding on to the foods I'm planning on eating when the time comes. I need to cook mushrooms. These mushrooms are edible. I'm going to cook them. Does he die during the temporal storm? We don't even know if that storm's ever coming! But just in case it is... Huh. There's food up here. There's literally food up here. <laughs> just in case it is, I'd like to peel off some of the roof, because we're going to use these cobblestone blocks and stairs as a means to make our safety dumb. Dude, I have a bad feeling something bad's are coming. Look at the lighting, look at the lighting. Nah, dude, something's off! Something's off! <laughs> I was gonna give it another second before I started panicking! Something's off! Get this out of my inventory! Right here. This right is gonna be the cube. I just need one more block. Sun might just be setting now. <laughs> Man, so now that I'm like looking around, it might just be the sun setting at the same time. I'm not going crazy, dude. Something's off. Look at that sickly yellow glow. Anyways, if stuff does get bad, the plan is simple. Okay. The plan's simple. We go in here, we put two blocks down, and we seal ourselves in this tomb until the sun comes up. I don't like the sound. It sounded like something was eating at the same time I was eating. Did you guys hear that? Also, there's a starfish in here. I can't eat this. Get out of here. So I did learn that the, uh, the fish, if they're prepped whole, do provide more calories. I'm not sure if it's, I think these, I think these give two fillets. Curious if the raw fish will give me more. Something's awry. Something's wrong. But I'm not going to let it slow my roll. No, and ain't nothing breaking my, uh, breaking my, 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 my powerful confidence in myself. I'm not gonna let anything slow me down. Yep. Yep. Just hexes going everywhere, every which way. Perfect. Can we open all of these? They could they interconnect. They all interconnect. An unlimited trap network. 
So you chat, we can see the stars. There's no fucking temporal storm. They're not. Oh, they're not real. eating a whole fish. Temporal storms aren't real. You've been tricked. You've been tricked into believing in something that ain't real. There's no such thing. If temporal storms were real, we'd see it. <laughs> I'm crawling on the ceiling like a fucking freak. <laughs> Yo, why the why it getting red though? <laughs> now hold on a sec. Why is it getting red though? I'm prepared to fill this entire fucking house with dirt. The gear's going down. Why is my gear going down? Any food I can eat is going into my inventory, including the worms. We don't know how long it's gonna be before we get out! Maybe it's not happening. It might just be red outside. It's just a little red. Oh, there's something fucking wrong. Maybe we just sleep it. <laughs> we go to sleep. <sighs> Where are the stars? Straight up ahead. You guys think we're gonna be okay? Look, chat, here's what we do. While we're in here, we can play with the clay we got. Okay? <laughs> we'll be able to play with some clay while we're in there. We'll use the ground beneath our feet to make clay. I can see some kind of dust coming down. In the distance now. Oh, fuck. Hang on. I actually do want to adjust the color correction on your side a little bit more because this is really dark. But I don't think there's much I can do to help. I can technically raise the contrast a little. I don't know if that's going to help you very much. It helps you at least see the grass on the other side now. You can see a little- Ah, oh, what the fuck? There's like some kind of- Some kind of green fucking dust just got in my mouth. Tastes like temporal storms. Uh. Ooh. This might be the last meal we get to have. might be one of the last meals we get. Dude, that's a giant fish. I know it's going to give me a giant amount of calories. I'll tell you what. Yep. We are really just wasting time. Well, chat. 
is the game gonna tell me when this shit starts? Because I know once it starts, enemies are gonna like be able to spawn in my house. Like that's the problem, is that when it starts, creatures are going to come in without permission. You will know. Cool, cause I wanted to start just like making pottery. Cause we're gonna need to make a crucible. We're gonna start, okay guys, everyone get excited. We're gonna start making a crucible. We're going to make this fun little pot. Which we're going to use to make copper. Ignore the horrible sounds of some wind outside. It's just wind, guys. It's just wind. Okay, so that's a raw crucible. Can I cheaply make shelves or do I really need... Uh, planks. God dang it. Well, we're just gonna, like, make a crucible. What else would we want to make out of clay? Saucepan? Mm -mm -mm. Well, right now we just need the, uh... We're gonna need the crucible. Probably gonna want to make a pickaxe mold. Probably gonna want some molds of basic tools. Guys, don't worry. This is all gonna distract us, so that when the when the uh, temporal storm comes, we will be completely vulnerable as a result of being just occupied doing other stuff. And that'll make it a lot more fun. Look at that. Also done. Chad, it's not even red outside anymore. Yes, it is. Yes, it fucking is. Of course it fucking is. Uh, fish check. Not, not even the fish are coming out anymore. Not even the fish are coming out anymore. Some more wood on the fire. Not even the fish won't be out here in this. In this hell. It's all gonna be fine. Gonna make our tools. Gonna get copper. Maybe we'll go outside and we'll we'll pan for some copper, chat. Maybe maybe we go outside and we pan for some copper after this. The storm's not that bad. And we got that charcoal to collect <coughs> I got some more of that. We are dust in my mouth. We got some more, uh, some more fucking coal, charcoal we need to pick up. Am I gonna need multiple crucibles? I feel like I needed them last time. I feel like I needed more than one last time. Well, I know I'm gonna need ingot molds. So let's make a couple of those. Very cool. Copper is just a myth. Chat, we get it either way this time, even if I have to pan to fucking do it, all right? Which is likely going to be what happens because we don't have a map to find our house again if shit gets bad. Okay, so realistically, 
We're gonna be sitting there panning for copper for the next fucking two hours after this storm's gone. That's just how it's gonna be. And you're gonna enjoy that. Don't seal that fucking door, you nitwit. Where did the other... Uh... Did we just watch a... Oh. Where the hell did the thing go? Any fish? Any fish in the shadows? No? You know what, chat? I do think I'm gonna go outside and pan for some copper in the darkness. Ain't nothing happening right now anyways. The weather's perfect for it. Is that sound? I'm going inside right now. After I finish this. Fuck that. Oh, fuck that. Yeah, fuck that. A shooting star underneath the clouds. Oh, shooting star just hit the cloud. Interesting. Chat, everyone just calm down. Stuff's gonna be fine. I sure wish there was one more fish to eat. But there isn't. Seems like all the animals just up and left. Haven't seen one since the... Since the sound started. Ever since the... Whatever this dust is came in, all the animals have been gone. I don't know where they left to. Sun's supposed to come up right about now. Maybe we'll keep another, just, just one more uh, log or two on the fire. Keep that thing roaring a little bit longer. But you know what? Once the sun comes up, which it will, it's gonna be a beautiful day. Oh, a fish. I thought they all left. Oh. I thought I saw one. Huh. Must have just been my... Oh, there it is there. I got it. Got it. We got it. <laughs> We're gonna be okay. Well, everything's gonna be okay. We're gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. No one's gonna. No one's gonna fucking die. There's no such thing as temporal storms. There's no. So what? What does that even mean, man? Just gonna eat this. That was me just touching the door a lot of times. Fuck. Fuck. 
fish is going to go out. Ain't no such. Look at Jen, it looks great outside. We've been burning daylight, not doing anything. We could have slept through that whole night. Man, oh, we could have done so much shit. I'm going to go get that. Ch I'm going to go grab my shovel once this fish is done cooking, which it is. Now, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're not going to sit around doing nothing all day. We're going to grab my shovel. We're going to go out and dig up that, uh, that there charcoal that we've been waiting on all day. It's finally done. Look at that crab. Yep. Just another day in the life. Another day in the beautiful life of living in this lovely valley. Yep. Not a worry on my mind. Oh yeah, that charcoal's done, baby. Get a look at that. Crack that bad boy open. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, we'll go ahead and bring that in a minute. I just want to toss this crab on the fire, the roaring fire. Yep. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and put this shovel back down. We ain't gonna need it. Put down the other shovel too. Yeah, we'll just lean those both up right there. No problem. All right. That crab done. Yeah, look at that. Those crabs are worth a lot of fuck. Those cook fast too. Holy shit. Crabs worth more total than most of the fish have been. Well, uh, had that charcoal. What was that? Oh, shooting stars. Wow, a whole lot of them. Oh, an awful lot of them. But hey, the music's not. Music stopped. Oh fucking Christ! Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab myself a. Uh... No, I think I'm gonna go ahead before I grab that. I think I'm gonna cut down this here tree. Is that a fucking snake? It's a bad omen. You know, to run to a snake like that this far out. They don't even, this ain't even their habitat. All right. I think I just ruined the fucking snake's, like, house. Earthworm castings. Oh, uh, roosters, a uh, roosters cawing. Chet, that must mean good tidings ahead. A uh, roosters just doing their thing. I don't think I want cassava seeds. I don't even is a chat is cassava an edible plant? I don't. E I've never heard of cassava before. Beets. Yes. Then planted, it will be. Chat, it's a beautiful day! <laughs> we were scared of nothing. You guys are all a bunch of cowards. That's all you is. And now it's a beautiful day, and I'm gonna make the most of it. I ain't gonna be scared of nothing. Yep. I'm going to collect my charcoal. Is there a fast way to do this? I think you just break it by hand. Two. Three. 
for shovel. I don't own one of those in my inventory currently, but I did only forget that I own like that they existed, and that's why I wasn't using them. For some reason, my brain just like forgot shovels existed because I lined them both up in this really nice looking place. Well, grab a shovel. Let's get to it. Now, this is the life. Just climbing into a big old hole and harvesting charcoal. You've had burning for the last two days straight. Completely disregarding the terrifying sounds you heard the night prior. Maybe that was the temporal storm. You know what I mean? Chat, it seemed scary. There was red lighting. Maybe the first one was just pretty chill. Yeah! Yeah! That was just a really chill temporal storm. And now that we've conquered it, by God, we have really truly nothing to fear in this world. That sounds like cope. Shut the hell up. My charcoal pile is a little ridiculous and I need a better system for this. Anyways. There. This grass needs to fuck off. It was just- that was just a temporal cloud. Yeah, we just had some clouds, chat. We just had some clouds. Stuff's gonna get better now. Stuff's gonna get way better. And I'll tell you what we're doing today. We need to cook up that clay crucible. We need that crucible thing done. So hold up. I'm just gonna dump some shit in here that I don't need. I'm hanging on to the food. Just, just, to, just to be safe. Just to be safe. Not that I'm, not that I think uh, we're gonna die, but just to be safe. I need to know, uh, I need to know how to make the... I need to know how, what the fucking, uh, dimensions are of the clay... Of the clay thing. Smelting, smithing, coke oven... Nope. None of those are what I'm looking for. Clay forming... Nope. Pies... I don't think so. Progression guide, pottery age. Clay vessels for storage, pots and bowls, as well as crucible and tool molds. Yeah, but like explain how I oh here we go pit kiln once the shape is complete place it up and fire it in a pit kiln Place clay products into a one by one by one hole then place dry grass sticks and firewood Peat and coal can also be used instead of firewood ignite the fire and clay products Okay Well, um, I have charcoal so that makes that easier. We'll use this corner because frankly God, my house is the most cluttered piece of shit. This will work. This will be where we cook. Wait a minute. You don't have much that's flammable. He doesn't know. I just have to move the baskets. That's all, which I was going to do. Chat, you guys are so scared. I just have to move the baskets. I mean, I can't do it outside. It rains every 24-7. What, do you want me to do it out here where it constantly rains? Every hour of every day, aside from the day before the apocalypse? But it's so much work to do it over here, chat. Come on, chat. What are you so fucking scared of? What are you so fucking scared of? First you were scared of the temporal storm, and now you're scared of a little bit of fire. You're pathetic. What the hell was that? 
I don't care. I don't care at all. Start again. That weird music. That music, that song, that never ending tune. I had all the time, but I can't recreate it out loud. But if I had to try, it sounds a little something like this. But like, not a, not like that exactly, more a little scarier than that. But the same kind of tune. And it's just kind of wigging me out because I do not believe that is normal. I do not believe it is. But I've now realized that... What the fuck was that? Thought I saw something, but it was nothing. <sighs> Stuff's just been freaking me out lately. I don't see why I wouldn't just add, uh... Three more of these crucibles, since I can't fit anything else in here while I cook this. Cause that's how we will do it. As if I care now. Chat, uh, do I just put down a, uh... What do I do now? I just light it on fire? What way I just light it on fire now? Sticks. Stick. <laughs> you fucking idiot. And now I light it on fire. Then logs. More sticks. I can't put more sticks. Oh, I, I need more. I literally need more sticks. Okay. More macaroni. Okay, now it looks like I'm gonna need a, uh, some kind of block or log. Well, uh, I'll tell you what. One thing I am willing to do is go cut down another tree, because it seems like the day's looking up for me, and honestly, I'd rather not... Why is this tree just... I, I, I want to make some more firewood. I'm gonna use the charcoal, but I need some more firewood in general. We're gonna die today? Why in the hell would we be dying today? Uh, you guys are acting like psychos. Someone get them in the straitjacket. Mods, grab the person you keep saying that and get them into the jacket. Please. I don't want them to hurt themselves and or others. Throw them in the jacket and then throw them in the deep hole. Where are my fish? I've learned to live with only those. <laughs> oh wait, I, I forgot I left one on the fire without cooking it. Heed our warnings. No. Why is it not lighting? God? God? It was one away. <laughs> That's what doubt gets you. Gets you killed. That tune's playing again. Same one as before. One that goes a little like...
That melody, that horrible melody. Who keeps playing it? Why don't you come out already? <laughs> Gotta burn my fish. Getting all worked up. <laughs> I'm acting like a psycho. Hear something on the roof? <laughs> Climbing up onto the roof lagged my game. That's not normal. So weird's going on, Chad. I'm telling you. But it's nothing dangerous, it's just weird. <laughs> I do want to reiterate so no one thinks that I'm walking back what I said. It's nothing dangerous. It is just something weird. No danger involved. Just weird. He's gonna die. The wind just stopped. The hard wind, the howling wind just stopped and you're telling me I'm gonna die. Uh, like one step away. One step away. Voice box, you're gonna drive me crazy you say that shit, dude. I'm gonna lose it. One step away. All right, from snapping. <laughs> what was that sound? Thought I heard something. I know it's not No Tilt Tuesday anymore, but you're supposed to have my back, even no matter what I do. That's the rules. Okay. Why, dude? There's so, I'm telling you, one of the things that's causing issues is, like, a very specific pixel, like, down here. Oh. Well, that's something I'm choosing to ignore. Alright, good news is this is why we live in the middle of the water. So when stuff like this happens, we can say, I don't care. What, what's it gonna do? Burn down the onions? I don't care. What's it gonna do? Burn down the fucking berry bushes that realistically will never cook berries? Or like grow any berries? I don't care. Don't know what that thunder was for though. What the hell was that? Did someone just jump into the water? That's weird. That's weird. The Nolcha. That music's starting to get louder. It's starting to get louder, chat. So in an effort to try to ignore it, I'm going to go ahead and grab my pan and pan for some resources while I hope that fish come in because I really don't want to eat more of my jerky. I'm going to pan over here though. Oh. oh, it stopped again. The horrid noise finally stopped again. Good. All right.
right, fine. I'll eat some of my wheat. But I'm not gonna like it. Oh. 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 All right. Ew, dude, that's just the sound that happens. You're ew. What was that? Wait, what's that? There's a green like orb. What are these? What the hell? One scared the crap out of me. Those things are getting closer to the ground. Every time, man. Mass extinction imminent. Nah, dude. Dude, we got one more copper nugget, dude! You know what that means, dude. You know what that means. Looking good, kiln. Looking good. Chat, yeah, you guys want to bet that if I walk five inches this way, I'm going to find copper on the ground? Like, I'm going to bet that I won't. So you guys can do the other one. Oh, I, I didn't. All right, chat, pay up. Am I gonna have to cover my- Oh, it's raining. Do I have to cover my fucking kiln? No. Yes. Well, that's mixed messages immediately. Yes. Can I just cover it with dirt? Does dirt count? Because I don't have other things. Leave and but the dirt won't fucking stay on it. That's the problem. If I surround this shit with dirt and then I do that and I put one more on this, it's gonna crush it. And if I see what I mean, I can't put one more up. shovel packed dirt you tell me I can just pack the dirt better see it in here survival guide blocks packed dirt just six dirt I can do that I'm having another what looks to be memory leak is what I'm going to interpret the uh, lag as, so I'm probably going to reload the uh, game in a second. Pretty sure it's just a memory leak that keeps happening. But evidently, by next time I play, I need to fix it. I'm, uh, I mean, like, I have a new PC outside, but I don't think it's actually like a PC issue. I think it's just some kind of map thing. What the fuck? Oh yeah, I need to eat one. Wheat. It's never not scary. Well, at least the rain stopped. Boom, dude. And there we have it. A beautiful kiln.
And that temporal storm? It never came. Wait. Date four. But wasn't the temporal storm supposed to come on day four? T today's day four. Sounds like a me problem after I save and reload my whole game. Because of all the horrible uh, memory leakage. Beep, beep, boop, boop, beep. Beep, beep, boop, beep, boop. Yeah, worst case, if it's a mod, uh, I will find it, get rid of it, get back to this exact point on a new save with the same difficulty and everything, and then we'll just carry on from that one. If it ends up being a mod that's breaking it. But considering it's now smooth again, it looks like some kind of memory leak. That's a fish baby. That's a fish baby. Hey, nice job getting caught by me, you stupid idiot. Hey, you look dumb. You look dumb getting caught like that. Small bass? <laughs> More like dumbass. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah. Dude, day four me is the rowdiest one of this whole thing, dude. I day four got me rowdy. I'm gonna cut down some of this. All the way. I want some roots to eat. One of my favorite meals has always been the roots. I want a snack. Post poop day tomato is what I sub for. It sucks because whenever someone says that, I have the sinking feeling that they're not subscribed and I have to like reread their message and check their name because I'm like, they're probably not even giving me money. But you were. You were one of the honest ones. Thanks. 31 months. Damn. That guy's been waiting 31 months for post poop day tomato, dude. That's some shit right there. Yeah, I'm an early investor. Yeah, I'm kind of like a I'm kind of like a Kickstarter backer. I kind of I got in the early in the hopes that maybe the stream would be good eventually. Is the sun already setting on this beautiful day? Well, that can't be right. The sun only just rose. Yeah, I know I could make a torch and speed up this whole process, but like then I have to micromanage the torches. It's begun. No, it has it fucking begun. If it had begun, we'd be seeing like, I don't know, temporal chaos. Which we're not, by the way. Which, by the way, we're not. Just gonna let this fish cook and then I'm gonna make these cattail roots as well. He doesn't see it, question mark. Look at you, you little rascal. Fucking saying random shit trying to get in my head, trying to fucking, like, confuse me, get me, like, all, like, rattled. It's funny. It would be. 
is what I mean, if it wasn't so sad. You're pathetic. What's that sound? What the fuck was that sound? What was that? What was that, like, hissing sound? Did someone play, play, play like, a bomb in my house? Oh, what is this? It's a fucking worthless rock. Get out of here. I heard, like, a hissing sound. It sounded like a creeper from Minecraft. There's a creeper in my house, dude. I swear I'm not joking around, dude. I heard it. Creepers are real. I really heard it, bro. Ugh. Wait, this isn't a mod pack? It's like people don't know. Either people are joking. Which is definitely a cut of the people that are doing it. For sure, for sure. We all know this. Or people really do think this is Minecraft. And that's such a shame. <laughs> that's such a shame. Dude. <laughs> some temporal storm, man. Alright, I know I was joking. But, like, I'm not even hearing the sounds anymore. I'm not even hearing the... I'm not even hearing the sounds anymore, but... I'm not even hearing them. My goddamn... My, my beautiful charcoal is gonna be done before this fucking temporal storm shows up. I'm gonna keep panning for gold. With any luck, once we have 20 nuggets of copper, we can make one bar. And then, we'll be cooking with gas. Everyone get excited. What a beautiful night for it. Why did my fire go out? I thought I fueled it. Must not have. Oh well. Just light that back up, no problem. A beautiful night. It'd be better if I didn't have all this fucking water and lilies constantly in my goddamn face. Another symptom of temporal storms. Make up more shit. Go ahead. Go ahead. It's not like it matters anyway. I've already figured out how I'm gonna die. I'm gonna be panning for gold, and like a wolf is just gonna bite my head off from the coastline. Like, I don't. No, none of it really matters. Not even one copper, dude! I don't want a flint arrowhead! I want what I deserve! I will not go hunting for copper again, you promised! I don't want that either! Maybe we just... Maybe we just turn in for the night. Yeah. We'll just... Get some shut-eye. Stuff will be better tomorrow. Yeah, we'll go to sleep. Hey, Bruce. Thanks for the raid, man. Hope you're doing well, my guy. We're just playing uh, Vintage Story. It looks like Minecraft, but it's a lot harder. Uh, and we've been waiting for a storm to come that said it would come on the 4th. A, a temporal storm. But it's not- it doesn't seem like it's happening. Oh god, Chad, I think we actually are just gonna catch some shut-eye. If the storm wants to come, well, I- I fucking dare it to. Alright. <laughs> I fucking dare it to, I'm sleeping. I'd like to see it come and get 
temporal storms aren't real. I fall asleep, happy, tucked in, knowing that I am safe. What the fuck is going on up in the sky right now? What the fuck is this? What? Huh? I don't care. Yo, my crucible's done! Dude! First of all, give me this fish. Look at this. Look at this fucking idiot. This little guy. Looks like we got a cube storm up above us. But there's nothing scary about that. Wait, what the fuck is that one? Wait, that one's like touching the ground. <laughs> Wait a minute. It looks like it's gonna just miss me if I stand right here. That one's gonna miss me if I stand right on this line. I'm gonna go get my crucible. I'm not scared of whatever's going on right now. Yep. There's been cooking down here long enough. There it is. Get a load of this. This is- I live like this. I, I- I really just did take a full look at my house for the first time since we started playing. And it just made me really sad. Lighting's getting all weird. Something's wrong. A little bit more firewood and get it on the pile. Temporal storms aren't real. I'm gonna head out and I'm gonna try to hunt us up some grub, all right? It's been a little bit since we've eaten meat. I want to make some more jerky. All right, I'm gonna head out a nice far distance from my house. Where I would be deeply unsafe should a storm or a tornado approach. That's nothing! That, whatever that is, is nothing. <laughs> All right, besides, it's day five. Storm happened yesterday. It was when it got all red outside. Okay. And that's... Fucking raining. Crap. Crabs, crabs, crabs. Sorry, dude. Sorry, man. You're basically free food. Oh, hell yeah. Where'd that other one go? That's nothing. I'm not going to worry about it. Besides, looking at the trajectory, it's actually going to only hit half of my house. Maybe. Wait. Wait a minute. Oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck, dude. Maybe I can move my house. I feel like I, my house isn't that hard to move. Maybe we just move it a little. It's only like six blocks in it. Do I just like not stay at my house tonight? That feels like the fix. Like, I don't want to be, like, hit by... Dude, that is a fucking solid block of storm. I'm not getting in that. Where'd that... There was a crab here. I wanted to eat him. But I think they scampered off. Yeah, they're gone. Oh, hello. Fresh meat? So 
Sorry, Bozo. Gotta turn you into jerky, you understand. Or you will, one day. Actually, I guess I should grab everything. All audio just stopped. All sounds have ceased. Oh, there's the crap. Sorry, is there a Yeti or like a, some kind of like Bigfoot over there, like knocking over trees? I don't care. <laughs> if you're gonna kill me, then kill me. If not, then just stay out of my way. This is why we live in the water. Even if something did burst out of there, we have an advantage as long as we take them on in the water. Oh, this is my land. The end is near. That ain't even coming our way. Oh, 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 Sorry, I have to eat food. I hate, I hate that sound. I hate that sound. That jump scares me every time. Okay, we probably aren't gonna get that much mileage out of the, like, game jerky, but whatever. We do wanna make the crab meat, though. Delicious crab. I'm kind of stalling. Did I just hear a chicken? I think I just heard a chicken. I'm kind of stalling because I... What the fuck is going on with that shit? It's like wiggling. Well, whatever it is, it's coming for, it's coming here quick now. It's probably just rain. Shit. It's got to kind of wiggle to it, you see that? Something ain't right. Something ain't right about that. Something's wrong. The way it's wiggling. Just kind of living off of the land for a little while. The crabs are really good, though. I think the crabs might be the best food we can get. Very easily killed. We can't, like, make elaborate meals yet. We're too simple. Our people are far too simple for that. I need to chop down more trees, but, like, I need to start planting trees. The place I decide to live isn't very close to any, uh, any trees. I have to run so far. But I do need more sticks. Right, once this is done cooking, I'm gonna run over and get a bunch of, get a bunch of stuff. I think. Uh, X. I don't even have a stick. I don't even have a stick. Okay, we need to go get stuff. Dude, until I know that this... Dude, I'm afraid to go look for copper because I know the second I go to look in any direction, one, I'm gonna get lost. Two, the storm's gonna come. And I'm gonna get fucked. We all know this. Doesn't take a fucking rocket scientist to know we're all gonna die if I go over there. The fog's coming.
That's nothing. That's just wind. I'm only gonna get spooked if I start hearing the sound. You know, the sound of like... Of like scary wind. But right now, that's just wind. That's just normal wind. We don't get worried about things like that. Hey, Tomato, how was your hyper shit TM? Eventful? Eventful. M many a shits. Oh, fuck right off. <laughs> oh, fuck right off! I don't need the wood that bad! Sweet! What are you- Did I just hear it from- Hang on, get to the middle of the lake. I thought I heard it like following the lake, like... Coastline. For context for people that came in from, uh, Bruce's side. I will die in one hit to a wolf. You are very squishy on the difficulty I'm playing on. I can't just fight a wolf. A wolf is an instant kill. I am not clothed. I'm gonna do this like this just because I want to try to use the last of the, uh... Knife's durability. <sighs> well, hey. I don't like the idea of there being a wolf out there. I really wanted that extra wood. We didn't get it. But hey. At least we have enough wood to make enough firewood to start up cooking up some other crap. In our crucible hole. Because, like, we are gonna need to cook these. Those need to be cooked. So, I guess let's, let's freaking start doing that. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we will. Uh, where's the fish I had? Oh, I cut it up. I'm stupid. We just have to keep our eyes peeled for predators. Like that of a herbivore creature. I see nothing. We begin. Okay. Yep. God damn it, I need sticks. But the sticks are over there. <laughs> Is there an easier way? Hang on. Activate survival guide. Activate pause button. Stick. Show me in the block section. Damn it. A wolf's just gonna jump out of one of these bushes, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, man, I fucked up. I should have clocked where it was. I don't know, and now there's just a creature out there. Dude, I'm just- look, we're gonna find copper any minute now. Okay, as soon as I'm brave enough to leave the coast. Which I'm not. FYI. There's this- oh, cranberry bush. It may take all night <laughs> to get a, to get copper. Are you a killer snake? Black rat snake. I don't remember those being poisonous. As a matter of fact, I've never heard of. Could I become friends with those goats and like convince them to give me their milk? Goats have milk. I know that I've eaten goat cheese. They don't make that from nothing. Oh! No, 
That was just me breaking my axe, dude. Why am I so jumpy right now? I'm like embarrassing myself because of temporal madness. No, because of the wolf, dude. If anything. Okay. Maybe if I walk up to them, I can see like a little uh, pop-up thing that'll be like, what the fuck was that sound? You guys got a wolf near you, or was that just the sound of you? And that's just the sound. Ah! Fucking rabbit. I'm gonna kill that thing. No, I'm not. Okay, those guys are damage tier two. I would call myself a HP tier one character. So, uh, I'm not even gonna bother stepping up on them. I ain't even gonna bother. Okay. I'm gonna plant my cranberry bush. You guys are doing so well. You guys are doing so freaking well, you guys. I'm ha I'm so happy. Look at all of you growing. Nice job out there. I'm trying to be nicer to them so they'll grow faster. Okay, chat, we're gonna do a coastline. The temporal storm happened. We have to accept that. Okay. We have to accept that and move on. I'm gonna follow the coastline. We're gonna look for coal. Wait, no, copper. See if we find any if we follow the coast. Around my lake. We're gonna not leave the lake though. I don't wanna lose my stuff. Like where I am. Okay, because again, we don't have any mapping. If we lose where we are, we're gone. Like, we're never finding our house again. Coward TM. Dude, I don't have a map. We, ha we haven't sweeped the coastline ever. That's the first step. We're looking for rocks on the ground. Specifically in mountainous areas, like this one, where wolves typically, uh, frequent. The hell is that? What is that, bones? Puffball mushroom. Hey, Google. Hey, Google. Can you eat puffball mushrooms? I ask Google. Only young, immature puffballs are edible. Hey, how old are you? I'm not even gonna fucking chance it. I'm not even gonna fucking chance it. That's a- that's a young one. Hang on. <laughs> Hang on. Hold up, dude. If we cook it, it'll cook out the poison on top of it. We gotta. Oh! Oh. We need more W's, chat. This is how we get one. Okay? You might be scared of it, but this is how we do it. Oh! You gotta be careful. Dirt just falls all the time. You end up slipping and breaking your neck or something. Copper? For context chat, uh... Oh, I hate that. It's just a chicken, but 
You never know when a chicken might have like a friend that's a bear. That's possible. I believe in anything really at this point. We're looking for copper on the surface because we will see it. We'll see like a big old pocket of it on the surface. Who's that idiot? They're sleeping. This is our chance. We move in. Okay, they got away. And I'm not going to go after the chicken. I have a lot of food right now. Any copper? Any, uh, copper? Can copper veins be visible underwater? Can I see, like, one under the water? He actually doesn't know. I ain't doing that. I ain't pro we ain't prospecting, all right? You're in a bauxite area. Copper doesn't spawn in bauxite. What are you implying? What do you what do you what, 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 what are you saying? What are you saying? Explain. Use your fucking words. What do you mean? No surface copper. So you're telling me if I'm gonna find copper, I'm gonna have to make a prospecting pick via panning for copper for likely the next five hours? Yes. Well, that sounds like a plan. Okay. Where's my house? <laughs> Where's my fucking house? Well, Tomato, consider that the Bronze Age took a while for humanity to reach. Add a mod comment to that person that says, uh, fucking, fucking asshole. Uh, add that. And then parentheses after it that says, real? So that I also know that I'm like, I was being serious when I asked you to put that down. And then ban them for life. <laughs> and then ban them for life. Dude, my house from here kind of looks like a spooky church. That's not right. Because if God was here, there'd be copper. Maybe that's why this place is abandoned. Maybe that, you know, that might make sense. If God was here, there'd be fucking copper. I know that for sure. Well, we have a lot of time. I guess I'm gonna pick up my old... I guess we gotta pick up the old prospecting pan. And get to prospecting. Everyone get excited. We got ourselves a long day of holding right click at these here bauxite sands, which at the very least do have copper within them. Yeah. I don't care. This storm means nothing to me. Why does my guy keep flowing up onto the fucking, like, land? Oh, this counts as being in water. Rain's coming in. Ain't nothing like it. Just prospecting for gold. Panning here on the side of the river. Hoping that maybe one day we'll find... 20 copper. Well, how many is it again? 20? Chat, how much is an ingot of copper? How many of these nuggets is it gonna take? 20 units or 20 nuggets? 
Because one nugget is five units of copper. You need 40. Well, it's a good thing we're starting early. He's so mad. Chad, if I leave this fucking lake, we will never return. We'll never find it again. We'll die. So let me tell you what's gonna fucking happen, okay? We're gonna be, everyone else on this planet is going to progress without me, and I'm gonna be one of those fucking documentaries in a million years or some shit, where people like, look at this, like, still yet unevolved creature that like, just, he, he never got there. He never got there. He almost got to tools, but look, you can see his fucking, like, his skeleton, he died here alone. Everyone else had copper. They all were good, but this is like the Neanderthal. They didn't really, like, this is like one of the Neanderthal's cousins that didn't really do it right. You know? I'm gonna die. I, let me check how much copper we have. Bro, hold up! That's Jet! I, now here's the thing. Here's the thing. I don't need to. I shouldn't pause when I say this. That's that's co the complete opposite of what we want to do. Here's the thing. Okay, I spent four hours of my last stream playing this game in the accursed year of 2020, and you want to know how much copper I got during those four hours? A big old zero, motherfuckers. Zero. None. Not one. Not even a nugget. So I'll tell you what. We're actually making really good time. <laughs> Fuck you. What's going on? What's up? Climb onto the roof. Everyone knows wolves can't. Dude, I found lapis. Uh, ditch this rock. No, I said ditch the rock. Is there a zoom button? Is there a zoom button? Is there a zoom button? <laughs> I'm gonna climb up onto the very peak of my tower. Is there a zoom button? Enhance. I see him! There's a whole pack of them right there. Oh no, they're right by the lay. They're right by where I get my trees. <sighs> my guy's getting stressed just looking at him. You hear that? Do wolves know how to open like like really clumsily made thatched doors that break every second? Right click. Fuck, dude, what am I gonna do? Fuck off! Kind of are. They kind of are, they're going the other way. You know you've gotten real jumpy ever since you got your colon cleaned out. I'm sure it's fine. Motherfucker, I am going to instantly die if even one of the crabs I attack and constantly eat were to turn around and be like, what's up? And snip me. Like, I would die. And those dogs won't stop howling. If they gravitate closer this way, we're fucking dead. I have to build a wall. We had to make something to keep them out. They're coming closer. <laughs> they're actually in the, they're in the same spot they've been in the whole time. I'm acting like a psychopath. <laughs> Maybe they'll just, they, it's all going to be okay. We just need to ignore them. They're just, they're just doggies. 
I oh! Okay. Oh, fuck off. They keep making sounds though and it's pissing me off. What if I antagonize them? I don't, like, what am I talking about? I'm not gonna fucking do that. <laughs> Rain's coming back in. Well, I need to- I have to keep panning for copper. Chat. Good news is we have like a window of time before... I need to make another, uh... We have a- we have a window of time before... Um... I lost all- I'm losing all my train of thought because they keep howling. I keep thinking they're getting closer. I actually don't know what's going on anymore. I'm completely stunlocked. Uh... Um... Uh, I close the door. Oh, fuck! <laughs> we don't have any firewood! It's getting fucking dark! And I don't have any wood! Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Fuck! Fuck! Here's what we're going to do. I pick up my grain. My... I pick up my fucking big old sack full of grain. <laughs> That's gonna perish in exactly 69.9 days. Oh. oh. And now I seal myself in the house for the eve. And when tomorrow's sun rises, those dogs better be fucking gone, or I swear to God, I'm gonna find something to do about it. I'll tell you what. Good night. Quite see anything. And I have to light this here, uh. And I have to light this here fire pit. <laughs> Any minute now, this fire pit's gonna be roaring away, dude! <sighs> I see no temporal storms. I'm gonna cook my puffballs and hopefully they're edible. <laughs> I'm gonna cook these up. If they're edible, that'd be epic. And at the same time, I'm just gonna pop open the survival guide, pause the game, and uh, just gonna make a torch. Uh, let's see, two dried grass and a stick. I don't have one stick. Yes, I do. I have exactly what I need. I'm not gonna seal us in a tomb without a fire to destroy the rest of our oxygen in there, all right? I'm not gonna fucking do it. If I'm gonna seal us into this one by two hole, all right, when the storm comes, I'll tell you what, I'm gonna bring a torch in so all the oxygen burns away and we die. All right, at least it'll be quick. Unlike what would happen if the fucking temporal storm gets us. May God help our souls. <laughs> I pray to God every day that we, we, we die on our terms. Instead of on the terms of the temporal storm, amen. You guys see any wolves? Here it fucking comes. Oh my fucking god, it's moving the rocks. Why is it doing that though? Why is that rock doing that though? The wolves are fucking frolicking around outside. I can hear them. They're splashing about. Guys, 
It's gonna be okay, dude. Let me just find out if it's gonna kill me. It's safe, it's safe! We eat those! We eat puffballs! They're totally edible! Okay. So, uh, here's my thought process here. I'm gonna wait here for a second for my buff balls to finish. Wait, huge idea. Chat, how, chat, how tall would you say one of the creatures is that spawns in this realm during this? How tall would you say one of them is? One by one? Fuck, I was gonna make a little crawling hole and crawl in so I could crawl out to look around. Are my puffballs almost done? <laughs> Are my... Is my puffball... What the heck is that? Maybe I can just take a quick peek outside. Oh, fuck that. Oh, fuck that! Oh! <laughs> Jet! Jet! <laughs> it looks like a... Like a block with legs! <laughs> I thought... <laughs> I thought it was... I thought it was like a block chicken or something like broke into my fucking house. And was gonna fucking kill me, man. Fucking Christ, that scared me very badly. Okay. Guys, monsters aren't real. And now that I have my puffball, we are able to seal ourselves fully within... Hang on, I actually want to go one step farther. You guys just hear that fucking oink? Wait, I need, I need, I need to light the torch. I need to light the torch. Light it! You know, I really... Oh, there we go. Guys, everything's gonna be okay. This, uh, this temporal storm is gonna blow over any minute now. Any minute now, we're gonna be right as rain. Actual coward POV. Motherfucker, read the title, my guy. Actual coward POV? If I die, I'm d like, it's done. I, I don't know if you've seen what I look like. I'm wearing a uh, wooden armor and full commoner clothes. And right now the world is literally starting to refract. The dimensions are twisting. And I hear sloshing outside. Why am I hearing sloshing outside? Oh fuck. If I communicate with them, they may leave me alone. Did you hear that? Did you guys fucking hear that? They booped at me. At least our charcoal, at least our kiln is still cooking away. I heard a growl. <laughs> I heard a, <laughs> I heard a fucking growl. God, you know what really calm me down right now? Some grain. Fuck is that sound anyways? Maybe the wolves are dead. Think about it. Maybe the wolves are dead. He doesn't know they're placing a breaching charge on the wall behind him. 
That's solid stone, motherfucker. It's gonna take a lot more than that. Why do you think we're using this wall? All of this around me is solid, invincible basalt. Aside from this low fertility grassy soil beneath me and this packed dirt in front of me. He doesn't know about temporal miners. Just, chat, just enjoy the sounds of like a really inconsistent stream of piss like onto like, you know, a concrete floor. Okay, just enjoy the sound of that for a while, okay? And stop distracting me with your lies. I will not enjoy that, I will not. Did we? I thought I actually heard a creature, dude. I thought I actually heard one. Whoa. Stuff's gonna be okay. Come in, creatures. Chat, I'm not fucking going out. <clears throat> Take a look out the window. I'd rather break this block and look out the window on this side. Then, like, open my house again. Then do it. That's the most powerful block I've ever seen. We can break this one for a sec. Oh, that just goes back to my house. Okay, I forgot that both of these sides are just still my house. Okay, fine, we'll take one look! Ah! Uh uh. Uh uh, I heard a sound. Uh uh. Nope. Uh uh. I heard. The second I walked out there, I heard, like, shuffling. Nope. Uh uh. I won't do it. Weak man with a weak colon. Oh, good. There's some kind of fucking thing outside. All right, I'm going back inside the box now. Happy? Happy? Face them. Motherfucker, you want to know what happens when a fucking caveman with copper spear, like one copper spear, goes up against an eldritch creature? They likely die, and they become a skeleton. Okay? That thing's gonna rip me in half. That was like a gorilla. That was like a gorilla. There was a gorilla outside the fucking house and you want me to go out and punch him. That'd be a Conan move. I'm not Conan the Barbarian, dude. I'm like Carl the Clown. I'm hiding in here and I'm not coming out. I'm not coming out until the storm has waned. Until the storm has waned, I will not leave this hole. He's beeping and booping. You know what that means. There is something on the other side of this fucking rock that is sloshing around in the water beyond. The fucking longest blowout of my life. Oh. 
No, I still see some fucking weird things over there. <laughs> I'll go bathroom. We'll let this cool off a little bit longer, dude. There's some shit hanging out with the goats. And I'm not doing that just yet. Why are you guys Monka Wing? What's going on? Oh, fuck off. There's. Dude! What am I supposed to do? There's like actually a fucking creature beyond the house. I heard it. It's making moans. It's moaning. It. Oh, what the fuck is that thing? What the fuck was that? But the, 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 the storm is done. Hey! Wait, I have battlements. Yeah, fucking asshole. Get the fuck out of here, you disgusting creature. That is a tier four damage creature. He saw he just threw a rock at me. <laughs> I saw him throw a rock at me. Oh yeah, nah, fuck that. You'll have to thread that needle something fierce, jackass. Leave me and my fish alone. He's dead! They can be cold, they can be beaten! Give me this. There's still more guys out there though, I saw them. I need a better door, chat. Okay, perimeter check. Perimeter check using the roof. Perimeter is clear, that was the only straggler of the entire event by looks like things. It looks like the other guys left too. Whatever this thing is. It ain't right, even looking at it makes me kinda sick. It's flickering in and out of reality. Despite its corroded state, it still shows exceptional quality and craftsmanship. The fine detail seems impossible to reproduce, probably why the traders favor it so much. Huh. I am way too epic to be defeated by something so normal. That's all I'm gonna say, man. God, that was easy. Imagine dying to something like that. Couldn't be me. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just cook up some fish because we have some and it's gonna spoil in three hours Doubters are crying. Yeah, doubters look pretty stupid, right? Like what did you think was gonna happen? Of course I was gonna lock myself in the cube The only chance you had was by taunting me so hard that I went outside out of shame and you didn't do it You, you weren't good enough at it. I don't know what to say 
You were unable to taunt me so hard I left out of shit. Where's the wolves? Hold up. Hold up. We don't we don't just walk outside. Do you think they got eaten? I mean I can't go back over there ever again. That's wolf territory. I, I literally will never go back over to the that the, the like that patch of forest ever again till the day I die. The wolves died, probably. Dude, the goats are fine. You're gonna tell me the wolves died? Yeah, right. I'm not getting tricked anymore. I'm not that. I'm not gonna get fooled by you. Yeah, right. The fucking goats are fine. They're cho they're totally fine. Oh fuck. We're going back to what we need to do to win. All right? And that's holding right click on this bauxite sand after checking the environment for danger. I actually relate very much to these goats. A powerful creature that wants to stay on its, you know, land and just kind of hang out and have a good time. But everything around them keeps trying to push them around. That's kind of like me. I'm getting pushed around. Why is this tilting me? Because you actively want to see me fail for some fucking reason. We're back to doing this. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I know you guys might have forgotten. But this is a holding right click on a lake with sand stream. If that was just a medium storm, what the fuck does a strong storm look like? What do you... Nah, dude, that was a strong storm. That's far away. I've got work to do. I can't let them scare me. One more copper. Fuck me, dude. This is so much <laughs> fucking work. It's gonna be so cool once we have the stuff we need, though. It's gonna be crazy. It's all RNG, dude. You see, the thing is, my RNG is just not good. I've got bad, uh, I got bad luck. You know? That's what it's really about. It's just bad luck. Four. Dude, if I feel bad about for myself, I, it actually comes in faster. <sighs> I guess you could say, yeah, Chad, I guess you are right. It is kind of a character flaw of mine that I just really can't ever get what I want or be happy ever. It's kind of just... I think it all started like when I was a kid and it really just stayed bad forever Like there was no real instance. There was no moment that really started it It was just like I was born and then stuff sucked from start to finish From point A to point B point B being the present. It's just always been the same level of just shit luck Always pulling the shortest straw You guys know those videos of like toddlers getting picked up by like eagles and falcons and shit and hawks and then just taken away and then dropped like 40 feet in the sky? That was me in all of those. Every single time my parents just kept letting me outside. No? I've seen that shit, dude. And I've lived it. It was me. Probably for the best you don't watch those videos though. How did you get back?
Hey, so you fucking telling the stories here? You get asked questions the whole time. You know, if anyone else was telling a story around here right now and that you fucking started asking crap like that, you'd be pissing them the fuck off. How about you shut up and just enjoy what I'm saying? So anyways, shit's been rough. It has. But you know, like... Well, I mean, like, hold up a second. I'm getting copper spearhead still and arrowhead. So, there's a chance that I might just get the copper pickaxe. Right? Right? Can you recycle those? Wait, really? Hold up, that's smart as hell, if possible. Wait a minute, are you suggesting I recycle? I don't want the quartz. I just don't care about it. When would I ever use glass? I use dirt for my windows. Are you- did you just suggest that I recycle? I need to go cut down a tree quick. I'm like actually out of- I'm out of wood. And I don't trust the woods over there anymore because of the wolf infestation. Look at all these fish just hanging out. What's your carbon footprint? Massive. As it should be. Ma bold. <laughs> Bold and rambunctious is what I would describe it as. Well, hang on. Perimeter check. Check. Oh yeah, we're still doing- we're still doing the Kekona, but positive messages bit. Recycling is great for every living thing. If we work together, we can reverse the environmental damage we've caused. Might as well cut down this tree too. While I'm here. Besides, I do need more firewood. This tree will break any minute now. At last. At last. What the fuck is that? Is that like a shaved, like, like that's a, that's the top shaved off of a scary, like, nether portal or something. Hey, I uh, checked that quick, but I'm nervous about it. I don't really care about the flax, mainly because I don't understand it. I don't trust that. Oh, I guess I have space for it still. Hang on, I'm just gonna to make sure this isn't like something horrible. Like, I don't want a monolith on my- on my yard. Where's my sticks? What the fuck is this? Slate rock. Dude, this is like bones! What do you mean, slate rock? That's shaped like bones! Mmm, I don't trust that. Yeah, no, that's bones. All right, well, I have to, I have to go back home and like sort out real food because I don't really want to cut into my copper. Hello, friend. I'm. Don't worry, I'm not gonna kill you. I've seen how much damage you do. <laughs> don't, don't worry. I would dare not. 
even bother attempting to do that. Ow! No wolves? I'm worried they're gonna be waiting for me. Well, we got fish waiting for me, that's cool. All right, so I'm gonna cut all these into firewood. A big old load of stacks. Too much, I would say even, but hey, we don't need that fucking window. And now we have a lot of firewood. I need to go cut down more cattails and probably just grab the roots and eat them. At some point, yeah. Perfect. Oh, whoops. I do wonder if I can melt these down. That would really change everything, wouldn't it? We're sitting on 12 copper. That's not bad. If only like voice box were still here to ask, dude. For a second, those goats looked like llamas. And I got really excited because I was like, that's a fun change. That's exciting. I'm here. Voice box. Can I melt down the, the like, tool heads I've been getting from my panning? Press H on them. It doesn't look like it says I can. Is that what you're trying to tell me? Then no. Alright. I'm gonna blame- I'm, I'm gonna take it out on you. Alright, so get ready. Fuck you. <laughs> man, that changed, man. Dude, stop hanging on the ceiling. This is his poop rage. His post poop rage. Either way, chat, he needs a chisel. What would they even, what would they even do for me? Ingredient for all of these things? Oh, you want me to make a freaking trebuchet? Oh, yeah, 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 now I got it. I just need to, I need a chisel because if I get a chisel, I can make a particulator link tool. There we go. You can break things down into nuggets. So you're telling me the best thing I can do with my copper once I have it is not make it into a, like, pickaxe. It would be to make a chisel and then chisel down stuff. You need to make a hammer and pick to start. I slowly blink, exhausted by everything around me once again. Starting to think it's almost time I kill those goats on my lawn. They're not gonna beat me. All right. And I'm thinking I might need the food for jerky. We went through a lot of it recently. Next time this door breaks, I go and kill one of the goats. They're gonna get copper picks before you. 
No, they're not. Because they'll be dead. No, they fucking won't be. Okay. I'm gonna go cut down a lot of cattail from over here. I'd like to make another basket. That's a huge skeleton. What the fuck died here? Is that gonna be me one day? Nah, I ain't, I ain't gonna... I ain't gonna die like that. No, you'll make a small skeleton. <laughs> it's fucking funny. I would 100% recommend you leave the bauxite area. Well, then I have to kill the goat so I can make enough jerky to survive what I would call my grand expedition. You're telling me to leave the church! You're telling me to leave the church! Huh? After everything it did for me? You want me to just up and pack up? What would I- what about my- what about the worms? What about- what about little wormies? One, two, and three. Oh. Alright, we can move. The worms are gone. You're right, there will be new worms, chat. There will be. Well, how do I- which way do I go? Do I go south? I'll never be able to bring everything! I'll never be able to bring everything. There's never gonna be enough things. We made such a- like a life for ourselves here, and you're asking me to just up and pack up and up and leave? We got 12 copper. We got 12 copper. That meant something to me. I don't know about the rest of you. Okay, it's fucking dark. I'm not going out there. I was thinking about killing the goats in the shadows, but I'm not gonna fucking do that. Okay, I'm really hungry. No fish have shown up in a while. Sunk cost fallacy. Dude. <laughs> Chat. For real? Go fuck yourself, man. <laughs> <laughs> you guys haven't been through what I've been through. <laughs> you, you guys... You guys don't understand. This is my country. We'll decide in the morning based on what I see around me. Okay? The problem is, chat, if I go in a direction and it ends up being cold zone, we're dead. End of character. This isn't like the normal game where we get a map. We are choosing a direction and surrendering our existence to it. Just like the- Just like the goddamn predecessors of all of us. Just like our ancestors, dude. That's empowering, dude. I'm just like them. I'm braver than all of you. Dude, there's something kind of badass about that that I think only I would understand. You guys wouldn't get it. We'll use the stars to navigate. They'll come out soon and then we'll use them to navigate. This one's gonna be the aggressor, chat. Here's what we do. We stab him in the back, and then we jump into the water. Oh! Jesus Christ! Ah! Ah! Why is it so lag? It's so... Well, it lagged so bad I couldn't even respond to what was happening. Maybe for the best. 
Maybe for the best, dude. Wow, man. God? Everyone shut the fuck up. All right, I think I found something important. This is a message. Sh everyone shut up. I died and I came back here. What is the... I found a bigger church. What the fuck? I used to live here once. People used to live here. In a time before time. What were they like? What was their story like? Oh, wait, hang on. It says on the paper that they moved out, like, two weeks ago. And it just looks like the place really went to shit right after. I don't know where they are now, though. That part's still a mystery. That's still interesting. That part's still fun. That, that We can still have fun with that. Okay, can someone explain? <laughs> can someone tell me what the hell's going on up there? I was like, what the hell? What? What, huh? I'm sorry, did I just take a wound? Oh, I'm stepping on, like, rusty metal. Okay, well, I think we can all agree that... Um... The what I see myself doing... Because I, I was having a lot of fun with this chat. But I don't think I have time to do another one right now. God, it's so laggy. I need to find out what's causing this lag. That's, like, causing the game to drop frames for me. And I need to cut it out of the pack or, like, fix the problem, and then I'll probably progress back to where I was for next time, is what I can imagine being, like, the plan. Because right now, uh, I'm not going to say I died exclusively because of the frame drops, but that definitely made it impossible for me to react to what was happening around me once those fucking goats all decided to charge me. Uh, it kind of became impossible for me to respond once the frames dropped to six when two enemies aggroed to me. So, I'm gonna figure out what's causing this problem, I think. And then, we'll loop back around. I think that'd be the best way to do it. Because I really, really do enjoy this. But it might also be helpful if I'm a little less rusty again. Voice box multiplayer? No, nah, I want to- like, chat, like I said before, I am much newer at this game than voice boxes as much as I'd love to play with him I'd also really like to enjoy it and experience it myself without anyone like being my like Like guide for it. I'd rather ju I just rather do that my way like that Because I really will only get the chance to get to that late game myself one time So I'm not gonna do it with anyone. I'd rather do it myself Besides there's something that's kind of fun about being totally alone in this one specifically like Minecraft Different story. This one? There's something really fucking fun about being totally isolated in Vintage Story. You- it feels- it, it is just something fun about it. But yeah, I guess we'll, uh, I guess we'll call it here for this one for now. This is not over. How much damage does an Aurox Bull do? Not much. I'll tell you- ow. I'll tell you what, that was not very impressive. But yeah, I reckon we'll, we'll, we will loop back around. Whoa, what the frick? Dude, we could have lived here in the gravel realm. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Nah, dude. No way. <laughs> Ain't no way, dude. All right, stream's over. Ain't no fucking way. I, I I can't I can't live like this
I I just won't. I, I we gotta go. It's over. You can't make that up. It was scripted. I scripted this. I scripted this. I scripted this. It's funny because I scripted it. I planned this. I planned this. That's what happened. That's why it happened. That makes me feel better. <laughs> it makes me feel it makes me feel better if I rip control out of this game's hands and say I did it. I did it. Everything was pre-planned from the very start by me, Tomato Gaming, in order to make the funniest dream possible. Yes, siree, yes, siree. He's such a pro. I know it. The game was rigged from the start. Yeah, I just gotta figure out what this mod issue is. Because it's really... I really, really like the surface ruins. I think it's great. I think it adds to the style of this game and the world a lot. But if that's a problem, I will have to trim that for sure and obviously it's not going to take that long for me to figure out what it is it's got to be something with world gen there's only like three world gen mods in my list so i will trim it see what happens see what changes and then we'll uh we'll get it sorted out for next time and then i next time we come back i reckon i'll probably start at like ready to go find copper and like established house and like food situation I'm not going to start from scratch again, but I'll pick out a nice place. You gotta be fucking kidding me, man. I've been walking around, like, just exploring while I, like, say goodbye. Whatever. Okay. I'm going to turn it off now. All right. Yeah, whatever. Whatever, dude. Whatever. I'll tell you what. We're going to be living in a place with copper when we do the next one. I'll, t I'll tell you what. But, yeah, next stream will be tomorrow. Who knows? Maybe it'll be more of this. I was having a lot of fun playing this, so who knows? Maybe it'll be, maybe it'll be another session of this. I don't know. If not, it'll be something else. It'll be, it'll be a good time regardless. So thanks for coming on by. I will catch you all tomorrow. If you gifted subs or donated bits, etc., I really appreciate it. That's awfully kind of you. Thanks. Thanks. If you, if you didn't do that, that's okay. That's okay, too. That's okay. You're not obligated to. I hope you have a good day as well. I guess. <clears throat> All right, get on out of here, you you scamps. Get on, get on out of here. Uh, I I I gotta go now. I'll see you all later. See you tomorrow, 3 p.m. at GST. Have a wonderful rest of your night. Goodbye. <laughs>